Good morning, everybody. How's it going? Hey, Becca, how are you? Good morning. Rex, I see you lurking. Hope you're all doing well. Yeah, I decided to do a daytime stream. It's been a while since I've done a daytime stream. Um, let's see. They were playing Persona 5 Royal. And we were... I didn't mean to sleep. No! Start over, start over. <laughs> I didn't mean to sleep. Uh, we'll... uh, close it, open it back up. Unfollow. No close. Uh, close game. <laughs> yes, lurking. Hope you're doing well. Just really busy finishing lunch break. Hope you're well. I'm doing good. I decided to do a little bit of push-ups and curls <laughs> just now before I started. That's why it took me so long. Um, I'm trying to get into better shape. Especially now that I'm handicapped. I'm still recovering from my ankle injury. Um, about... About two weeks now, actually. Um, oh yeah, I was reviewing the footage, or at least the screenshot I took of the injury, of when I actually uh, landed on somebody else's foot, and I really could have just like snapped my ankle, probably. So luckily, I was wearing my basketball shoes, and because I saw that I actually landed on my left foot first, which was the foot that got injured, and and luckily I don't like put all my weight on one side first. <clears throat> so yeah, my right leg was able to land on the floor uh, before I sprained it, sprained my other foot on the other, on the guy's leg. Um, so yeah, definitely fortunate. And funny enough, it's been a package wrapped. Ooh, my shoes came in. I'll look at them later. But yeah, it's very fortunate that I didn't get uh, more hurt than I could have gotten. Uh, this particular ankle sprain was not as bad as the previous ankle sprain like three or four years ago. Um, it was interesting. But also I've been really trying to rehabilitate it from uh, doing uh, ice baths. At least before my foot. I didn't actually like jump in a whole tub of ice. But just soak my foot in like very cold water. And then also soak my feet, or my foot, well I guess I do do both feet since I'm just sitting there. Uh, in warm, warm water with Epsom salt, which is really good for regenerating uh, your body. Um, I guess it's the one instance that being salty is good. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I'm going to study. So we just got out from Madarami, Madarami's palace, so we can't leave the area, leave the shop I should say. Um, I think we already watched all the DVD, so I think we just gotta study. study. Oh, what is bad today? It's easy to focus on studying when you're stuck inside. Heck yeah, it's actually lucky. Lucky. Yeah, when it's raining outside, it makes me sleepy. <laughs> Oh, there's only two. I thought, oh, it'll probably give me an extra note because of the rain. Yeah, there it is. Nice. Mm, glad you're feeling better. Thank you, Becca. How have you been? Um, but yeah, I hope to pretty much be healed by the end of the week. I probably should have still stoked my feet in the Epsom salt. I'm just so lazy, though. <laughs> it's like. It took me a lot of, uh, well, I guess since I can't really do much, like, uh, normally yesterday I would have been playing volleyball, so I'm like, I sh probably should have soaked it then, but yeah, the other nights I would double soak. I'll soak in the warm first, then just leave it there, and then I'll turn cold, and then I'll soak it in again. Um, yeah, good stuff. You doing okay? I'll DM you. All right, sounds good. I see. Uh, you'll probably have work soon, Becca. Uh, wait, what are we talking about? Oh, what are you talking about? This 
train. Uh, Part-time uh, job as a drag. Oh, I mean the job at the beef bowl shop. Oh, yeah. I've been meaning to work there <laughs> at the beef bowl shop. Um, because, there's, yeah, this politician social link that we can get. So we'll definitely do that once. Probably once uh, we finish at Matarame's Palace. Where do not want to go? Even if the pay is good, running the whole place by myself just sucks. Oh, geez. This pale young man is going to be my co-worker at his beef bowl shop. Uh, that job magazine said it was fun, friendly workplace, and I wish another part-timer would join. Oh, we're gonna join. Cause we need that beef bowl shop. Um, job. Well, the grades are out. Heck yeah. How'd you do? I had a perfect score. <laughs> Damn, I'm dead. I always hated. I'm pretty sure a lot of people too hated and still hates exam time. It's always, you know, stressful. And the real dividing line, my allowance is safe for now. <laughs> Wonder what score I got. I finished a little higher than the average score. Nice. Nice. Is that a good example for your friends? Oh, yeah. I think we got charm. More charm. Bam. Nice. Uh, do we need to start inviting Yusuke to hideout meetings now? Oh yeah, our fight's not over until the exhibit ends. Keep your head in the game. Let's see. Uh, see how is Star Rail? It's going pretty good. Um, I've been grinding daily, of course. Got to use all my whatever energy, <laughs> whatever the energy is called in that game. Um, right now, I'm working on. Let's see. I think I have six five stars. Let's see. We have Silver Wolf, Welt, Bronya, Kafka, Ice Boy. I cannot remember Ice Boy's name. <laughs> Let's call him Ice Boy. Five. I think I have one more that's not Trailblazer. Maybe. I'm gonna assume I have five, and then plus Trailblazer is the sixth. No, I have Bailu, that's right. So I do have six. <clears throat> um, so I've been working on the three Nihility. Uh, character, well, I guess two. The third one's actually Sampo, because Sampo pairs really good with uh, Kafka because of the. Uh, dots they can apply um well it's still the character i have to uh share with everybody <laughs> so that's my support character in fact i don't know if i have you added do you i'm assuming you play too i don't know where my star rail code is <laughs> i can put in chat There it is. Put my friend code in chat real quick. Oh, there it is. Um, well, the original came down. Yeah. <laughs> we have Kafka and Walt. Yeah, she's really good. I. Uh, I think I've pretty. I haven't maxed her out. Her talents are pretty much at eight, um, and then some of her other ones are pretty high too. Uh, she's not max level yet, so I can't even get some of the other uh, traits are in there or traces, and they're in that tree. I kind of like that they have extra unlock nodes as opposed to you know Genshin's talents. Those talents you only have like three, right? That you up upgrade. So I do like that they kind of added a little more. Um, 
Yeah, I'm not even sure if I'm done with Welt. I think I have his light cone at level 80. <clears throat> Forget if Kafka's light cone's at level 80. Uh, I do need to level up some of the other light cones for the other characters. But yeah, I try to do like a one character a week to like focus on. But even then, like once you get to like level 8, 9, 10, like traces, it takes forever <laughs> to grind up those. Um, this material ascension items or whatever. Uh, let me see. What happened? Uh, how have you been since our last talk? Anything bothering you? Oh, it's a new character in Persona 5 Royal. It's the Counselor. I forgot his actual name. <laughs> so we're just gonna keep calling him Counselor. Uh, if you got time, I'd be happy to chat with you again after school. Yep, we can become closer. I think I might do that. Um, let me read the other texts first. Wanna go to the palace today? I'll leave it up to you to get everyone uh, once you've decided when to meet up. Uh, well, what do you want to do? Should we meet up at the hideout and head into the palace? Nope. What you up to? What are you doing right now? Ain't we going to the palace today? I'm still hanging out in the hallway. Let me know if something comes up. Uh, I probably will do the counselor thing. Gotta sit here and think real quick. Um... Oh yeah, I can uh, switch to DVD, so let's do that before we meet with anybody. I think we're gonna meet with the counselor man. Counselor man. I really don't remember what his name is, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, but let me get that DVD rental. I think in the previous, I don't remember in the uh, original version if, um, like you actually just straight up bought all these DVDs. Might have just been the books I'm thinking about, which you can still do that. But let's see, any new books? Yeah, I bought all these books too. Oh, this is new. A fashion mag magazine for girls with unique tastes. I love how it's called Vague instead of Vogue. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, we'll say right now, going back to Star Rail, like... It's funny, because a lot of times I'm trying to catch up in Genshin's events and stuff, but... In Star Rail, I... Well, I guess the previous events I had to catch up, but... Um... This time, I pretty much just finished it right away. I feel like I do spend more time doing Star Rail stuff. I think there's just less... Like, a, uh, we don't have to be as involved... Uh, when playing Star Rail. Especially with the auto battle and all that. Uh, so it's just nice. Wait, I do have the Counselor Persona, right? Pretty sure I do. Yeah. <laughs> it's just this Magatama. I'm pretty sure originally this Magatama probably was not the, like, the counselor type. I'm pretty sure they added counselor Arcana in this uh, version of the game. Let's go ahead and talk to counselor, counselor man Maruki. Let's go see him. Thank you. That'd be quite helpful. Okay, I'll be waiting in the nurse's office. I can also find some way to occupy myself in the meantime. Send me a friend request, sounds good. I will check that after stream. I need to do my... Dailies. It's nice that the dailies in Genshin, or in Honkai is very quick. I can probably do it in like 5 minutes, if not less. As for Genshin, that usually takes 10. <laughs> 10 minutes to step by. I don't know. I think to some point it does feel like a chore, but... And gotta do it for the free crystals or whatever they're called. See, I've been getting a lot of students coming in here ever since I arrived here. To be honest, it's been kind of a relief. That whole mess with Kamashita was the reason I was called here, after all. They warned me of a lot of students. Uh, wait. They warned me a lot of students had been impacted. I knew there would be a lot of free floating anxiety. Um, but when I actually got to talk to everyone, I was pleasantly surprised. 
Most of the things on everyone's minds were college ent ex entrance exams, relationship problems. In other words, typical worries for high school students. Some did not open up about deeper issues, or some did open up about deeper issues, but not the majority. Some students are still struggling with the scars from the incident, yes. It's kind of funny, speaking of Welt, <laughs> this uh, character kind of reminds me of Welt, just like a more, I guess, um, real life version <laughs> of Welt. Typical dude in the coat, glasses, shaggy hair. And they made it more mobile friendly than Genshin? Yeah, for sure. I only did Genshin or mobile on, wait, Genshin on mobile <laughs> when I just needed to condense or if I couldn't get to my computer in the day. Um, I did that a lot uh, when I visited Texas last year. Like, <laughs> that was funny because I did bring my laptop to Texas, but in the case I couldn't actually get on my laptop while I was in Texas, I definitely used my phone to just condense real quick. Um, I would say it's kind of funny, like, for a while before Fontaine came out. Um, I kind of ran out of stuff to kind of do, other than artifact farming. And as we all know, that sucks. <laughs> artifact farming is very lame, because we always get disappointed from the drops. And the same with the relics in Star Rail. Like, uh, what, this past week has been the double um, relic drops in the Corrosion dungeons. And I pretty much have only gotten like one or two barely usable <laughs> relics. The other ones are like, you know, defense uh, percentage, main stats. I'm like, <laughs> what is this? But, you know, it's just, at this point, it's just all fodder for eventually when I do get good relics, I can just fuse them all away. But, <sighs> anyways, yeah, for Genshin, that's pretty much how it has been for like a month, I'd say. I just kind of ran out of things to do in terms of like using my resin. Um, I still have a bunch of quests to do, but I'm too lazy to do them. <laughs> That's probably why I don't have as many um, gems or Supremo gems uh, to use on Wishing. Um, I wish for Yelon, but I got Diluc instead. <clears throat> so now Diluc is at the first constellation, which is fine. But I don't really use Diluc at all. I don't know, I don't really like his attack style, I don't know. But maybe I just don't have him built properly, so that's why he's kind of like lackluster. Um, but yeah, mm -hmm. so yeah, no 5 stars, at least new 5 stars this banner, so I just got to hold that. Um, as for Star Rail, I did get Kafka. Um, I think if I keep getting enough for temples, I will try to wish for her Light Cone. <clears throat> but other than that, I guess I'll just save for the next thingy. But he attacks a little, yep, yeah. I mean, he has the claymore, he's just, uh, makes sense. It's wild swings. But I guess you're supposed to, like, pair them up with his, uh, elemental skill. To kind of, like, I guess, increase the speed <laughs> of which he attacks. I don't know. Uh, at least his, uh, ult charges pretty fast. Um, so maybe I think it's just, like, two or three hits, ult, high fire, <laughs> and then, yeah, let's try it. Uh, there's other characters can do more damage. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my um, Kachin can probably do more damage. Though she is like... I think she's Constellation too. So she's already like... better innately because of that. And plus, like you said, she just attacks a lot faster. <clears throat> um, I do have her physical attack build. Um, Diluc... He's kind of like a hybrid. I guess, yeah, once he gets the fire infusion from using his ult... And then he's, you know, pyro damage all the way, but yeah, like you say, he swings his sword very slowly for his basic attacks. Um, but I guess that's why Claymore users have that um, charge attack, where it's like just constant swinging. <laughs> that's like their speed attack. <clears throat> I don't really use it though, because it's really, again, hampering. Especially when that game is all about smacking the enemy a couple times and dodging. Um, so yeah. Unless you have a shield, or I guess you can just tank the damage. Then using charge attacks on Claymore users is not that great. Um, I think for my heaviest damage dealer right now, like speed-wise, DPS-wise, it's probably um, Yanfei. Because, you know, you just gotta time all the charge, the attacks and charge attacks, and then ult. 
so yeah, I think she could do the fast or the most damage in the shortest amount of time. Um, of course, Yula could also do a big, uh, you know, big damage if uh, her ult crits, and I can hit like a hundred and some k, which is nice. Um, other than that, yeah, that's pretty much it. In terms of like DPS. Um, as for other characters, they're probably they're pretty much all other uh, sub DPS characters because they just had to do damage based off of elemental reactions. But yeah, those two that I mentioned are pretty much the only ones that can like kind of do a lot of damage by themselves. Um, of course, getting buffs from you know Bennett's ult and you know whatever other little benefits we can get from other um, teammates like. Um, Shogun's uh, elemental attack. It's funny because I never actually read what it really does, like the specifics. I just know, of course, it just um, does uh, electro damage every so often, every time you attack with a basic attack. So I definitely pair that up with uh, Yanfei <laughs> so that they can get that overload um, proc. Uh, C6 Bennett and Duluk are friends. So I heard like. I suppose it's controversial, <laughs> controversial, even though it's a game, but, you know, people have their differing opinions, but uh, apparently C6 Bennett actually, so it obviously is good for other pyro characters, so if anything it probably boosts my Yanfei even more, uh, since I do pair him with her a lot, because um, of what it gives a 15% pyro infusion bonus or something, um, but I heard that kind of like hurts other characters. I'm assuming basically the characters that have physical attack buffs or whatever, like if you stat it into physical damage. Um, so, um, some people say you shouldn't uh, open up that constellation. So I'm just sitting here with Bennett's like, you know, notification saying that oh, I can uh, open up his constellation, but I'm like, I don't know if it's good or not. <laughs> but then I guess there's other characters that you can pair up with the characters that won't benefit from Bennett's uh, ult after you C6 him. So you finally got C6 Bennett because I wanted more Star Glitter. Nice. It's funny because I actually got two extra Bennett's so far from this current banner. <laughs> I'm like, I don't need more Bennett's. I wanted the other new character. I forgot Lynette. Is Lynette in um, this banner? So I know you get it for free. Uh, but I don't know if Lynette is on this banner. I didn't really pay attention to that. And I also did not get her from the banner. Which is unfortunate. I see you played with uh, Dehaya and damn, nice. Yeah, I do have her that I built. I used the um, the new relic, or not relic, uh, artifact <laughs> in. Um, Samuru, where it buffs her HP, or buffs HP. Um, oh, she has never yeah, C4, lucky. Still don't yell on, definitely no Lene. You don't want Lene. <laughs> Lene kind of looks like Lynette's like sibling. Is that how it is? I have not really looked at character descriptions or anything like that. I just see them. <laughs> but I guess they're related. Lene and Lynette. They have very similar names, so I, I suppose they should be. You want him? <clears throat> yeah, I like the fact that his ult is he jumps in a hat and <laughs> he bounces around. Oh, they're twins. Oh, I didn't know that. Man, they should have made it so they're both five stars. But of course, people would be angry. <laughs> it's like this. Give me five stars. Well, I mean, just split them up into different banners. I mean, like, different cycles. Boa. It's what it is. Um, uh, but yeah, so far, I am kind of proud to say I have not spent money on Genshin, nor have I sent, spent it on Star Rail. I'm trying my best to not spend, because, <laughs> you know, I know that uh, they're going to re-roll them eventually, so I just got to wait, and eventually maybe I'll get it. Uh, Lynette inherited the cat features. Oh, what? Are you surprised I haven't spent money yet? Yeah, I just been faithfully playing, and the game uh, 
reward me for my faith. <laughs> because, yeah, I do have a lot of five stars. Of course, I don't have a lot of constellations for those five stars, but it is what it is. Um, what else? I don't know. But yeah, I have explored a little bit of Fontaine. I've done the underwater bit, I'm trying to get all those waypoints. So some of those waypoints are very hidden, and I don't have that much time to explore. <laughs> so I probably have like half the waypoints in all of Fontaine. Um, but I will say the swimming is pretty good. The mechanics are really good. Uh, this is what I like about this game. You can play them without being forced to spend money. Exactly. Yep. Just gotta dedicate your time and energy. To doing all of it. Yeah, I think this is what, year three of Genshin? Wow. It's been three years, hasn't it? Time flies. I remember when I first played it. I played it for like the first month or so. Then I took like a two or three month break. So I missed out on like Zhongli's first rotation and Venti's. Then I came back. <laughs> and then I never stopped playing. Um, I think. I think so far I've only missed two events. One of them being the major event. Of course, the month or two I took a break from it. Um, and then more recently I did miss out on one of the events because I didn't realize it was finishing. <laughs> it was one of those shorter events though, so it was just like, I don't know. I think it was basic rewards, so nothing too crazy. No crowns. I didn't miss any crowns. I have a lot of crowns because I just can't like commit <laughs> to crowning anybody. I do. I did crown. Let's see. I crowned Yula, Ganyu, and Bennett. So I got them at uh, level ten talent. Other than that, I'm kind of like hoarding <laughs> for the rest of the crowns. Um, these are your first uh, limited five star kitchen snuck in before me. Beforehand, oh yeah, I wonder if was your first five star. Uh, I think. I'm not sure if I told you or I just told people in general, but my first five stars were Kaching and Mona from the same temple <laughs> on Standard Banner. So yeah, they came like back to back almost. Never again have I had two five stars on the same pull or same temple. I don't remember which one came first, but they came together. <laughs> I think I might have had another four star with it, but it didn't matter. <laughs> I had, yeah, Kaching and Mona at the same time. I don't even know if my Mona is built all the way. I don't know. Uh, it's just so many characters I have in Genshin that I don't know who I should be building next. Uh, I think since they gave us Lynette and she is my first Fontaine character, I've been trying to farm for her. I've been doing that boss a lot. Um. I don't like the fact that that boss you have to choose which version of it to fight <laughs> to get you know the proper drop. Um, so the first time I fought it, I thought it was the Nemesis version of that boss. So I fought that one first, and it gave me the wrong one. I'm like, dang, <laughs> I wasted one fight. But it's okay. It's only 40 resin, and I have it for some other um, character in the future. I wonder if uh, Lene is the one that uses those. Um, it would make more sense if he gets the fire crabs uh, drops. Uh, yeah, Yoimiya come twice within five pulls. Well, I wanted Yoimiya as well. She's so, like, happy go lucky. <laughs> that kind of goes with her character design in terms of, like, her being a fireworks person. <laughs> it's very lively. Head pulls on the same pull. <laughs> It's when you walk into a conversation and you hear the wrong thing. Mm, it's a different song and dance. Yeah. It's funny because yeah, I only did the Nemesis fight once and I'm like, oh, it's the wrong drop, so I never fought it again yet. Um, yeah, I've just been fighting the Dirge version. Um, try to remember, I think for everyone's like, how however many materials you need for their ascension, it's like 40 something of the boss material or whatever boss drop. So I'm 
pretty close to fighting it enough times already. <laughs> uh, you have a weapon. Oh, for Yoimiya? Nice. Yeah, I tried to pull for her during her recent banner recycle, but nothing. I didn't even get... I don't think I reached pity at that point either, so unfortunate. Um, but yeah, it's been a while since I've gotten a 5-star before pity. I think the last one was my Hu Tao. And that was like, what, six banners ago or something? <laughs> That's a long time ago. So yeah, me, um, or I guess Hoyoverse is <laughs> not nice anymore. <clears throat> we'll see. We'll see what happens. Some teams were st still struggling with the scars from the incident, yes. But at the very least, I'm glad the ones who came to me have taken some steps towards recovery. Oh, I am doing a social link thing, so I have to use this guide to maximize my uh, social link game, aka I am cheating. <laughs> Oh, no one's watching, right? I mean, wait, you guys are all watching. Oops. That's okay. We want optimal. Uh, so both the choices, first or last choices, correct. So they have, huh? Which is my snobby voice for no reason. Um, Alright, hanging out back. It sounds good. Have a good day at work. Or where are we going? <laughs> I'm assuming work. But yeah, have a good one. Thanks for stopping in. Uh, let's see. Uh, well, that's not to say I've gotten a sense of every single student's emotional state. Either way, I hope my worries end up being groundless after all. Yep, no problem, Becca. Have a good one. Take care. Well, it's almost lunchtime, too. So hopefully you have something good to eat. Yeah, I saw my good old morning protein shake and I took a bite out of this crumble cookie. <laughs> I had this. So I think it was like two days ago. I'm pretty sure it's like a client. Because clients like to, you know, gift the office stuff because, you know, they come for counseling and so the way they show appreciation is gifting things, right? Um, yeah, somebody brought in a whole box of crumble cookies. Um, I'm pretty sure. It was a 12 pack. <laughs> it's like, Jesus. This big old box sitting in the count uh, the kitchen. I'm like, oh yeah. So I had two of the cookies. <laughs> but if y'all ever seen my pictures of the caramel cookies, you know they're huge. They're like that big for cookie and they're like thick. And so yeah, I can only take like a couple bites at a time. I'll go ahead and uh, put in Discord. Those caramel cookies. Oh, it's so big. <laughs> Is that Cookie Monster? Raccoon? Cookie Raccoon Monster? <laughs> Man, they're huge. Um, so yeah, I took like two bites out of that this morning for <laughs> breakfast. Uh, I looked at the, or someone showed me the nutrition facts, and apparently a quarter of the cookie is like 90 calories or something. So I'm pretty sure those two bites <laughs> was 90 calories. Um, but yeah, I'll probably eat more later. I can't eat them all at one one time anymore. Yeah, I find myself not gorging as much, I guess. Um, I do have the stomach for it, but I don't know. I guess it's one of those things like, why would I need to just overstuff myself? I might as well just split the meal into two or something like that. Let's see. I know I'm not the most reliable guy, but remember, you can always talk to me too, or two, if something's bothering you. I am the counselor here, you know? If nothing else, I'm good at listening. It's cool. Right, for those who don't know, I actually thought about becoming a counselor myself, a mental health counselor. Um, that's actually where I met Manda, um, the one semester I went. But, um, yeah, I decided it wasn't one for me. Probably because I just don't like interacting with people, <laughs> like randos, like face to face. I don't know. That's probably just me being introverted still. So, if I ever break out of it, I guess I could still go back. You know, it's never too late to do anything. As long as you're still alive, you can do something. Um, yeah, buy cookies that are 
All right, 20 calories each, protein ones. I'm trying to remember the brand. I do remember a brand of cookie that's protein. It's like Lenny or Kenny's or something. Somebody and somebody. It's like two people. Some, some. I don't know. No, but nice. Yeah, protein bars are really good. I need to buy more because it's my last <laughs> clip bar. How many calories on this thing? Uh. 250. This is 68 cal or grams. Yeah, Lenny and Larry's, that's what I get. Nice, yep. Yeah, I've seen them. Maybe I should buy those. Instead of protein bars, get protein cookies. Oh, yeah, I'll check Amazon, see which one's um, reasonably priced. I might just get more clip bars. Oh, we'll see. Maybe I'll get both. <sighs> But yeah, definitely these these bars and you know those cookies are definitely good to snack on, really in between meals, or to you know just straight up replace your meal. Um, yeah, I don't know how big my stomach capacity is anymore, but definitely eating a lot is painful. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know. I decided not to become a counselor at that time. That was like. That was a long time ago now, actually. That was like 2016. I think I tried to go to school to become a counselor. I got days, you know, the semester I went, but yeah, I just, I think also it's because I didn't want to take out a loan or like, you know, do the financial bit part of it because, you know, grad school is like the <laughs> pain to pay for. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It's just, I don't know. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, pack for 12 is 20 bucks on Amazon. Ooh. It's not bad. It's about like a dollar something for each. And those cookies are pretty expensive, right? They're probably like two bucks a piece. Generally. Something. But yeah. I don't know. Anything's possible at this point. Um, but yeah, for now, I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. Just work my two jobs. They're really chill. But I guess if it comes down to it, I will have to you know, make career choices. Different career choices or whatnot. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty expensive. And so that might not be a bad idea. I hope hope they have like assortments. Because I like trying different varieties of flavors before picking one. Um, so every time I do order snacks or something from Amazon, I try to look for variety packs. Variety is the spice of life. Anyways, having said that, it's a little awkward that I have to ask you for your help, but... You remember how I asked you to help me with my research? Of course. They do? Ooh, I'll definitely look into those. I said you'd be helping with my research, but don't worry. It won't be anything too difficult or intensive. I just need you to listen to what I have to say and work through some questions with me. Um, but let's see, maybe I should start at the beginning. I can tell you a little about uh, what this research is for. What I'm studying now is pain felt in the mind, or perhaps more fancifully, in the heart. Some specific examples include the pain of someone uh, saying hurtful things to you or being separated from those you love. Maybe this would be clear uh, pain defined by abstracts like trauma or stress. Bodily, uh, physical pain can be thought of as something necessary, an autonomic uh, response to injury, illness, whatever. But what about pains felt within one's heart? Uh, that pain isn't born from any tangible problem in our bodies, right? It's something strange and immaterial. I guess it goes to show there are still a lot of mysteries in our own hearts and minds. That's very true. And I, well, I want to learn more about these internal psychological pains. Now, this is my question to you. When do you truly feel pain in your heart, Dream? When someone betrays me. <laughs> that's true, that's, yeah, that's probably the best choice, actually. Even though none of these choices will actually get us closer to the guy. Um, but yeah, I would say when someone betrays me, that's when my heart feels it. It's like, I trusted you. Uh, 
I do feel a little bit, you know, like guilt and stuff when I lie or if I lie. That's why I don't lie. <laughs> a lot of times I, yeah, I can stress the truth, but I usually don't lie straight up. I can't even do it to like protect somebody. <laughs> I don't know if that's like my next stage of, I don't know, evolution where I have to like be able to craftily, uh, you know, remix the truth <laughs> to, uh, protect people, but I feel like better to just say it outright, like, you know, <laughs> it's, I, I always feel like the truth will come out regardless on what you try to do. It just is. Wonder, <laughs> one day it will come out, so better not to be caught up. So yeah, when someone betrays me, it's probably where I feel the most hurt. I see. Yes, I can sympathize there. Uh, sometimes all it takes is one betrayal for intense trust to turn into intense pain. Yep. True that. It can be rough. It doesn't feel good to struggle with pain in your heart. But with that in mind, how about the pain of a broken heart then? After all, that kind of pain is only born because we fall in love, right? Mm -hmm. Do you have any thoughts on this kind of pain? Oh, hell yeah. Uh, but, for the sake of conversation, uh, apparently the first or last response is going to net me the most things. Uh, this is the hopeful answer. To see for new loves. Because when you your, your heart broken by somebody, then it just pushes you to find something better. Um, the seed for new loves. That, yeah, it's probably the more hopeful answer. And honestly, that's what we need in life. Just more hope. We we'll hope that things will be better. Uh, so yeah, it's a seed for new loves. <laughs> I never took you for a poet. That's me, baby. <laughs> that's the dream speaking. But it's a wonderful sentiment. A very positive way of looking at it, yeah. It's gotta be positive. It's being negative doesn't really help. Uh, internal emotional pain can be difficult to deal with. Though some say it's always coupled with their- or with other feelings. Yeah. That is also true. And I agree, of course. I think that's a fair assessment. Though, personally speaking, I think if uh, pain can be avoided, it should be. Maybe it shouldn't exist at all. Mm. Wounds of the heart are much harder to de uh, detect, and in a way, they're far more complex than physical injuries. That's why I'm doing this research, to save people who are suffering from internal pain they keep holding on to. You helped me realize that purpose again. Thank you. Uh, doesn't matter which one, they gave me the same thing. Did that help? Trying to practice more humbleness, humility. <laughs> got those two choices. Did that help? Slash, don't worry about. It. Don't worry about it is the more like. Uh, I want to say aloof answer, just more condescending answer, kind of. But did that help is a more humble answer, I think. A response. Of course, thanks to you, I can articulate my thoughts for once. For once, I can sense Mercury's gratitude towards me. Nice. Level me up, bro. A uh, chance to receive the effects of charge and concentrate at the start of battle. Ooh. I believe that, uh... I'm not quite sure what charge and concentrate do. I think that doubles my damage on certain attacks. Maruki taught you how to achieve flow. Nice. Yeah, I love how they use all these psychological terms, because flow is definitely a psychological term, even though it is a but yeah, anyways. Okay, I think that'll do for today. Well? Mm -hmm. Why do I feel like I'm forgetting something? Whoa. Oh, your mental training! Oh, uh, no. I didn't forget about our promise, of course. I'll teach you tricks for mental discipline, and you help me with my research. Just like we decided, right? Oh yeah, I forget that they... Give us extra SP every time we meet with them, so it's actually a really good uh, thing to meet up with Maruki like, as much as possible. Well then, how about something like this today? Thanks to Maruki's mental training, my mind feels stronger. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, 5 SP is pretty good. 
Because that's one extra spell, for the most part. Oh, and here. Never a bad time for a snack, right? Yeah. Yeah, meeting with that guy is really good. Especially early game. They get extra SP and a healing item. And social link. So good. Oh, this is Maruki. Do you have time to talk right now? I'm taking a breather. Just finished my last counseling session for the day. And I thought I'd thank you once again for your help earlier. Uh, good work over there. Thanks. A lot of students came by to talk today. Uh, hopefully they got something out of it. But to be honest, it's pretty tough juggling this job and my research at the same time. Uh, thanks for agreeing to help me out. Or help me out. I might be looking to you for help more frequently from now on. It'd mean a lot if you could lend a hand. Alright, see you later. Sounds good. Yeah, I might be able to hang out with Sojuro, but I probably won't. Yep, we have the city armor. So I definitely want to go to the laundry mat. So yeah, I won't hang out with Sojuro. I will be doing some laundry. I never really took advantage of this first time I played. Um, uh, let's do two of each. Men, oh, covered in paint stains. Uh, let's do three male blows first, since we have more male characters. Oh, never mind. I'm out of male character armors. But yeah, this is really good though. 400 yen and a little passage of time for really good armor. I smell soap from the bathhouse next door. <laughs> Much cleaner than I expected. Old and ghastly dress. Very Changsa. Uh, Shikigami dress. Alright, we're definitely going to equip our characters with this new stuff. Oh, we can read a book. Um, charm. Or is that vague? <laughs> uh, same thing with guts. Be knowledge about internet crimes, charm, proficiency, knowledge, medjet menace. Is this about guts? Be knowledge about internet crimes. Learn the charm to hook up with somebody. <laughs> oh, geez. Uh, proficiency. Look at this medjed menace. I feel like this should be guts, but... Medjed menace. Um... Oh, knowledge. It is knowledge. I don't want knowledge. So let's do knowledge. This is charm. Maybe I should do charm. This proficiency, we kind of get that from other things. So I guess we've been getting charm from other things too. I don't know. I hate this. <laughs> I hate making choices. Um, mm -mm, let's just do charm. I believe charm. We, if we want to get to high levels of social link with Anne, we have to get to level five charm. If I'm not mistaken. The ABCs of picking up ladies. <laughs> Just this picture of the author. That smug grin just irritates me. <laughs> it's kind of funny. No, no. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't realize how long you've been reading. So how far did you get? Only halfway. Uh, seems like you still have some pages left. You should continue some other time. But oh, we're almost at the station. I say that was an efficient use of your time.
Do you ever use the study corner in the library? I always end up goofing off at time or at home, and not many people know of it. Uh, but isn't the environment kind of a problem? Have you heard the rumors about the transfer that transfers to it? Oh, him. Yeah, he used to be all anyone ever talked about. But you remember Mr. Kamoshida's big apology? The transfer students, kind of old news now. <laughs> my recent test scores haven't been so hot. If I don't shape up, my allowance could be in danger. Not my allowance. As a high school student, <laughs> you gotta get that allowance. It's possible to apply math even to an abstract concept like beauty. The golden ratio used in the Mona Lisa and the Parthenon is uh, a famous example. But a different ratio has been used in Japanese art and architecture since ancient times. I'm sure you've all heard of the silver ratio. Now then, dream son, take a look at this. <laughs> so what? Uh, the golden ratio is 1 to 1.618, but do you know the silver ratio? Oh what? <laughs> That's so random. So, I don't, but Google does. So let's just ask Google. Silver ratio. Soccer. Silver. Ratio. Tattoo. <laughs> Autocorrect is killing me. Um... So ratio is 1 to 1.414. It's very random. When are they achieved these numbers? Pretty sure they'll tell us. That's correct. You can see it's closer to a square than the golden ratio, right? Mm, yes. <laughs> One theory says it's because Asians have rounder faces than Westerners. Which I do. Uh, so they prefer a similar shape. A what? <laughs> and this ratio was used to, uh, or used in things like that paintings and the pagodas at Hiryuji Temple. Well, one you should all be familiar with is B4 size paper. What? <laughs> I have no idea what B4 size paper is. Those proportions are the silver ratio. Wow, really? Dreamkun seems kind of smart, doesn't he? Well, you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. Oh yeah, I hear that mascots that are seen as cute have faces that are close to this ratio. In other words, if you use this ratio, you can make cute things. Like twitchy emotes. <laughs> it is true that mascots tend to have roundish faces. <laughs> Speaking of Morgana right here. Super round. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? I mean, your big ol' head's on the screen. It's pretty funny. Uh, there are 15 days left. What's the plan for today? Uh, palace? <laughs> I think it's time to go back to the palace. What are we doing about the palace? Ain't we meeting up? If you don't know what to do, let's just go! Yeah, let's go. Oh yeah. Let's meet about the hideout then. Let's give him hell. Yusuke, you have not explained the basic things to me. Ah, the world or the sky, right? It's absolutely necessary. Please help me. It's important to me. Hey, Yusuke has such a deep voice in Japanese. I think it's kind of deep too in English, but it's super deep. <laughs> Japanese. その人間が感じてる現実の具現化だ。俺たちにパレスはあるのか。いや、万人にあるわけじゃない。主に強い欲望、歪んだ主観の持ち主が持ってる。ま、ほとんどは悪党だろうぜ。かもしだとかまだら
思ったより簡単で名前とあと場所を言うだけでその人のパレスに入れちゃうの場所あ要するにまだらめで言うならアバラヤが美術館みたいな初めて行く時はどうするんだまだパレスを見たことがないならそうなんだよそこ若干クイズだよ今後ちょい厄介かもまあ大体のことは承知したわからないことがあれば素直に経験者を頼るとしよううん任しとけ新人そういうのはモナに聞いた方がいいと思うにしてもまだらめまさか酷暑なんて言い出すとはなあんなふうに怒りをあらわにしたまだらめは初めてだおそらく本気で訴えるつもりだろうどうしようやられたら勝ち目ないよねだが6月5日の個展最終日までは向こうも身動きが取れないはずだ単純に忙しいはずだし期間中に裁判など起こして自分の肩書きにケチをつける具は犯かすまいならそれまでにまだらめの心を盗めばいい酷暑なんて絶対させっかよこっちがてめえの本性を暴いてやるってのはい。Um, back to the palace. We could go to Memento's, but I'll probably wait till after we finish Madarame's palace. Which honestly, we can probably get to the end of it here. Like, this. This, uh, trek right now. Oh, yeah. Let me give Fox Boy a new name. Has to be Kitsune. Talk about me. Fox. Da Vinci. Da Vinci. <laughs> This guy. Kitsune no men ni mio na shippo da ro? Yes! Aburage da! Aburage? The heck? Ma, yo karo. Ok, shiogata. Kimari da na! Aburage! That's too much. Yes. <laughs> I have no idea what Aburage means. Fox. It's gonna be Fox. Oh, what happens? Clown. Obviously Fox, but I wonder who... If Joker doesn't say Fox, I wonder who chooses Fox. Probably Morgana. Let's do Fox. Foxy. Because Kitsune is fox in Japanese, I believe. But. Fox. Fox is English variant. <laughs> he doesn't care. Whatever you want to call me. So, this time, I'm going to go to the house. あや。スタメン。最初のメンバーってこと？フォックスが加わって戦力としては申し分ないが、大人数は目立って動きにくい。今までのことも考えると、最初のメンバーは4人。あとはバックアップに回った方が無難だ。だからって、リーダーはスタ
Shikigami dress. Ooh, reduced physical damage. A Japanese style outfit made out of paper. Strange. Uh. Oh, interesting. I wonder why. Oh, because I only have one of these. I was going to say, <laughs> like, shouldn't have two of these. Um. Oh yeah, Morgana still does not have <laughs> better armor. Wow, that's pretty good. Ooh, agility plus three. A Chinese dress said to be woven by a fairy. Give him a duke's coat while he's not doing anything. Honestly, I should actually put this on one of my other characters. So mono bonus just increases our SP. Cool. Do I really want that? Maybe I should. Nah, I already have a lot of ice characters. So. Anyways, whoops! I went to go one more. For some reason, I got stuck. Poor Chuck. Let's go. All right, let's get up in there. Security's still down. Thanks to all my work, <laughs> hard work. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Come on, let's just keep going. It's funny. Oh, I didn't sell all my stuff, but that's okay. Oh, what? <laughs> There's no point to these uh, stairs. What the heck? Why is it even here? <laughs> the shadows. Growling. Oh, it's this guy again. Uh, speaking in Psy, or nuclear. Nuclear! Uh. Oh, this, this thing has sooty uh, armor. I forgot. Ow. I also forgot that does a buttload of damage. It's okay, though. It's over. Just use some of these like lower level healing items. If I have any. Oh, there it is. 20. I definitely won't use these in battle. 20. <laughs> I'll just use Dia. Uh, that's the security room. I don't think there's any items in here. I, oh, I was gonna say, I can't even go back in. Uh, there's no items in here. Item. Rappy portrait. Oh, what? Oh, it's another map thingy. Not for sure. I think that could be another pamphlet. Let's take it with us, Joker. What if we have to? Probably not, but might as well. No. Hey, ain't this pa uh, pamphlet different from the one we got before? You're right. It says it's the second out of two. Oh, and it's the rest of the map. That we can use it to find out where the treasure is, right? 
I suspect it's in the innermost part or point of this place. Our palace. Uh, the most suspicious spot seems like this main hall here. Hmm. We will need to pass through the lounge and the gallery in order to reach it. The deeper in we go, the tighter security is going to be. We need to advance carefully, okay? Treasure chest. Nice. Revival bead, heck yeah. Portrait. A oh, locked door. It's locked. Oh. Lasers. It feels like I might touch them accidentally. Let's be careful as we go through here, okay? Oh, these things. They're weak against fire. They're not weak against fire. How about wind? It's not wind. I don't remember what they're weak against. Corpse bird. We were able to catch one earlier, but whoops. I remember what it's weak against. Could be ice. Alright. You know, honestly, it would make sense if it's ice, since normally now we should be using Yusuke. Uh, let's try to capture it, I guess. Then, let's talk. Uh, I gotta find out if you're a weird human or not. It's like, but you're a weird throat spread. So it's gloomy, so we gotta cheer it up. Hey, uh, so you know I'm just a little kid, right? You're supposed to go easy on kids. Are you stupid? Do you go to school and get stupid grades? I'm good at PE. <laughs> Do you actually need a brain for PE though? <laughs> oh yeah, hey mister. You know when grown-ups uh, say kids are cute? Do you think they really mean it all the time? Uh, I'm cuter than most kids. But yes. I forgot what he said anyways. Yeah, grown ups are cute. I thought they were supposed to be cool. Alright, nice. Pretty sure I'm full, so I need to toss one away. Oh, well, 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 well. Uh, it's a moon. Uh, dang, <laughs> I don't want to throw any of them away. Technically, this one I don't really need. I want to get it just so I can at least save it to the compendium. Oh, it's curse. Oh, it's fire. Fine. I will get rid of this. I'm pretty sure I saved it in the compendium. I saved it into the compendium. So yeah, I guess that... Um, it's locked. Whoa. Oh, there. I can't get to those treasure chests. power. Yeah. Get that experience. I think as much as I can, I'm gonna get the experience for that persona, yeah. Hmm. yeah let me see something. I think this one yeah, it needs to be level 15 for freeze boost. So long. Uh, 
How do I turn off this thing? Oh, I need to open the shutters, that's right. How do I get to the shutters? Strong looking one over there. Oh, we've seen that one before. Oh, it's probably that um, big cat enemy. Oh, control room. Yep. Definitely want to kill this one. We'll need to disarm the security. We'll ensure we have a safe infiltration room. Sounds good. We're coming for you. Yeah, it should be easy. Step aside. <laughs> That's not the same enemy before. I think they're weak against... Probably they're weak. They're weak against ice. Let's... Uh oh. Uh, we have something that can. Oh, then st stun him. No! No! That's the one I need to not be enraged. Might as well buff his attack then. You wanted this! <laughs> Gathering power of the wind. Uh oh. I don't like that. Uh. Let's do this. Oh no, I'm dumb. <laughs> of course you would do that. Uh. Uh oh. The lucky punch. I'm pretty sure they're resistant to wind. I don't know about guns, though. Oh no, we're all gonna be reached <laughs> at some point. Oh wow, nice. <laughs> Mona's pissed. Uh, I think I should guard. Cause this guy's about to wreck our shit. Uh, let me see something. I don't think I really have anything. Move all stat debuffs for our allies. Decrease attack. Let's try this. Let's probably kill this guy. Wait, don't kill us. Oh, summon. That's different. Oh, he's back to normal. That's right. Makes sense. Uh... Oh, damn! Raging temper. Nice. Uh... Still decreased defense. I feel like I should just attack it though since I have buffed attack right now. Oh well, whatever. Headbutt! Oh damn it! Stop summoning people! Burned! 
I'm pretty sure it's resistant to wind. Let's just try to finish this guy out. Oh wow. <laughs> All the shots missed. Uh, let me check. Nope. Oh, flexible shock though. Hell yeah. <laughs> I love how we take the shock. If we attack someone that's shocked. Media! Oh, so there are skill cards in this game. Nice. Nice. Rampage. Nice. That's gonna be really good. Nice. Phew, that guy was tough. There's a chest back there. <laughs> was it on a different level? Oh, well, pretty easy. Oh yeah, you dropped some kind of card. Uh, skill card is a special type of item used to teach one of your personas a particular skill. These cards can only be used on personas uh, James currently has in his stock. The card will be consumed upon use, so employ them uh, wisely. Oh, we got a lockpick. Can't wait to get the skeleton key. So we don't have to craft lockpicks anymore. Ooh, that's for Yusuke. Yeah. Go for Yusuke. Let's turn that shit off. Password. No. Password. It's probably on the other wing. Thick parchment. Oh. Hello. I hear the intruders already got past the central garden security. Yeah, I just got a call early to change the password here too. What too? It better not be simple. Well, I was having some trouble coming up with a good one. For now, I set it to the numbers for Lord Matarame's feet. What? Lord Matarame's feet? <laughs> what are you talking about? Let's get back on duty. There's a chance the intruders are nearby. Matarame's feet? <laughs> the hell is that supposed to mean? Maybe his shoe size? Yo, Fox, you know the, that bastard's shoe size? Actually, I've never heard him mention it. <laughs> Are we sure that is the proper password? Matarame's feet. What do you think that could mean? It's probably a statue. So let's take a look on this side. Matarame's feet. So what's all about this feet business? Tell me. Oh, it's this guy. Let's check fire. Let's make against fire. Uh, ice. Check of Rosto. Boom. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't think I'll just kill the big boy. Oh, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Thank you. Attack flow, baby. What's this with you? I don't know. Uh, it's probably ice, to be honest. Let me check ice. Oh, 
<laughs> oh, it's just straight up dead. <laughs> uh, I wish we could hold it up now. <laughs> it's down. Well, I guess we just kill it then. 200! Good. A lot of Rami's feet. Oh, there's Marami. Look at his feet. There's something written here. Here we praise our most holy lord, Marami. The one ray of hope in this depraved world. He stands alone as his two adept hands paint into the future. None shall ever match his excellence. <laughs> He's really puffing his chest out here, ain't he? Hold on a moment. Could this be the spot of Madarami's feet that uh, the security guard mentioned? It's at his feet. All right, but isn't the password supposed to be a number of some kind? Hmm, I do believe there are numbers here, though. One, a ray of hope stands alone. With two adept hands, none shall match him. That means one, one, two, zero. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That must be it. All right, shut it down. Password accepted. Disengaging security protocol. Nice. Whoa, that opens all sorts of stuff. We'll definitely be able to go more places now. Come on, let's get moving. Let's go get these chests. That was locked. I didn't realize it was locked. Ooh, B chain. That heals everybody so full. DC vials. And unfortunately, it was not any equipment. That's okay. Let's see. Oh, I was like, what's stopping me from moving? Uh, this did not open. Um, what a giant painting. Indeed, it bears such a bizarre texture as well. It is as though I could simply slip inside. Oh, oh what the? You okay? But my hand, it actually entered the painting. So we can go, uh, so we can go inside of it? Well, I don't see any other path for us to take. Let's give it a try. Going in. How dare you trample on my tranquil bamboo garden with those grimy feet. You shall not leave alive. What the heck was that? We're probably just hearing Madarami's thoughts. There's no need to panic. Madarami. Oh, we're in another painting. Hmm, so this space is not merely one, but a multitude of paintings. You're telling me they're all connected? Which one goes where? That, uh, we will have to continue to find out. Hey Joker, can't you spot the connections with your skills? Oh. Jump out of the painting. So he dares, calls us thieves, who dirty his heart. The one who's solely the very nature of art itself has no right to accuse us of such a thing. Hey, what's up, Mandeth? How are you? You feeling better since yesterday's uh, craziness? <laughs> Tired, no. I forget, I don't think you're able to drink coffee, right? I think you're a tea person. Maybe I'm remembering details incorrectly. It's Peacock. Yes, it was wild, but it's a little better today. Yeah, I don't like coffee and I have no tea in the house. What? Should fix that. <laughs> Do you usually drink like tea bags or, you know, brew tea from tea bags? 
We used all the tea, or what? Let me get up on that Amazon. Say, yo, I need some tea. Hey, Sabo. <laughs> Not all the tea. Mm, so what kind of teas do you usually drink? I feel like we had this conversation, like, years ago. Either cold brew tea or, or yeah, cold brew tea or we brew it. Yeah, I've actually... No, I, I did tell you about the high tea, like, adventures. I don't brew it that often, but... Oh, wait. What is this guy weak against? We don't know. But yeah, I'm still, like, halfway through that bag of Thai tea. But I'm just so lazy to brew it. <laughs> you like black and green teas? I like fruit teas the most. So yeah. Yeah, Thai tea yummy. Yeah. So I guess you ran out of all the Thai tea. Yeah, it's definitely hard to make it correctly. I still have not gotten, like, a golden ratio <laughs> of, you know, condensed milk to tea. Um... I don't know. Maybe I just need to watch the video tutorial <laughs> on how to make three round of everything. No. Unfortunate. Do you plan on restocking that? Like yesterday? <laughs> um let's see what I wanna do. I need to find out what this is weak against. But I definitely wanna knock that down. <laughs> um, it's not weak against ice. I didn't even check fire. I feel like it absorbs fire. So it's either wind or electricity. Let's try electricity. Oh, you just found out? No. Oh. I'm not sure when we're going to the store next. You might just hit up Amazon. <laughs> I need it yesterday. Uh, let's see. Let's try wind. Oh, it's wind. Uh, what do I want? Get all these. Yeah, I don't think I had one of these yet. Yeah, possessing... Dog Ghost. He's uh, paralyzed though, so I can't actually talk with him. So let me just get some more Jack Frost. Power. Or experience. <laughs> Jack Frost. <laughs> Yo. Oh, do you have it like Jack Frost plushie or something like that? Yes. Hmm. Kind of sad in the sense that they actually like you know I just went to Metrocon in July last month, <laughs> about like forever ago. But um, I didn't really see any like Persona like plushies. Like I see their you know art or whatever, but. I don't see that plushies. I actually wouldn't mind getting like a collection of personas. Or you know, demons, I guess. <laughs> you have Jack. Uh Jack and Lantern. Or Jack Frost. So you have Joker and Jack. Nice. And Kormaru. Ooh. Oh the Jack Frost? Nice. Yeah, I feel like Jack Frost is like the main persona that people know about, or whatever. I don't know, it's like the... I'm not sure how you would word it or phrase it. Just the one that everyone knows from Persona. You have a teddy! Nice. Your friend got you the teddy? Is it like... Like how big is the teddy? Is it like this big or like that big? <laughs> like can you hug it or can you only hold it? Hmm, more big paintings just like the ones we saw before. There's something off about these though. Yeah, some of them are empty. You got me a blow-up version of Teddy and then a handheld version of Teddy. Nice. <laughs> so it's like you have brothers, like Teddy brothers. One big brother Teddy. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if they had like a, a voice box in it? So I just like said Teddy lines. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that would be annoying actually. Because <laughs> English Teddy is very annoying in terms of his voice. <laughs> That'd be awful, yeah. <laughs> I think maybe everyone to get annoyed at something. Just 
Press the Teddy button. Then you beat it up. <laughs> like, shut up, Teddy. Yeah, I do realize that, um... Yeah, Persona 4 and 5, they have the mascots be, like... Compromised, I guess? Because, you know, Teddy goes into, like, a dark hole, and then you have to, like, get him out. But that was a very short segment, right? And then, uh, no Morgana, we know. We'll go into their dark moment in which we have to get him out. But they didn't do that for Persona 3, I guess. Cormar was... Its own person, <laughs> or its own... I mean, it's just a good doggo. It's never... No. There was no Shadow Dog, right? It is Shadow Koromaru. That'd be interesting. Um, it looks like these ones are all completely different. They're even French with no paintings at all. That's strange, uh, but we don't have a choice. Let's go, Joker. Are uh, we going in? I guess we're going in. You yeah, know, Shadow Maru. Or Shadow Dog. Alas, this world is a desert filled with laymen who cannot understand true beauty. This little drain of my skill is inevitable when I am surrounded by such mediocrity. So he's gonna blame the world for his declining skill. <laughs> of course, the true narcissist blame the world for him sucking dinkies. <laughs> um, and that bastard never had any real talent to begin with. He's been a fraud all along. The gods, even in their dormancy, are worshipped constantly. People gather under shrine gates, offer their money, and return home fully satisfied. Art is practically the same. In the end, it is all just a matter of imagination. Huh? Even if that's true, that doesn't give you the right to be deceiving people. You bitch. Uh, let's go through the gate. Hard work is not what makes a sapling grow thick with green leaves. Too many young people do not see the true value in youth these days. What fools. Is it truly wrong for an expert such as myself to capitalize on that youth before it wastes away? Yes, <laughs> it is. What the heck? He's basically saying he's jealous of young talent. Yeah, because he's a uh, no skill having <laughs> scumbag. Look at me. I was turned into a cat, but I'm still fighting. Age <laughs> isn't a valid excuse. <laughs> Hey, look at me, I'm a cat. I don't even have thumbs. Press the button. I see. That's where we're going next. Look, another painting. So passing through one hidden route leads to the formation of another. What an elaborate ruse. It's highly likely there is a new path through the paintings. We should investigate, Joker. I can't get over how deep Yusuke's voice is in Japanese. It's like... Oh, what? Huh? Wait, this camel. We're back at the first freaking one. Okay, hopping into your next session. Have a great time. All right, sounds good. Mandeth. Have a good session. Hopefully nothing wacky happens. <laughs> no tilting conversations or anything like that. Or else I guess you can just get another burger. <laughs> um, so they're not connected exactly as they seem. We've had to keep trying until we find the right way. <laughs> All the burgers in my mouth. I guess in yours. Because you'll be the one getting the burgers. Yeah. <laughs> getting drunk on burgers. Um, this one always has a lot going on, so not holding my breath. Ugh. Gotta hold your... Something, something, I don't know. <laughs> Let me just stop there. But yeah, have a somewhat good time. <laughs> then, I guess. Or maybe you can, like, make it a good one. <laughs> You'd be like, I'm not having a bad session with you today. I refuse. And they'll be like, <gasps> and then you have a good time. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Just let me know how it goes. If I'm still streaming. Uh, could a ship skirt across the ocean if its crew had to constantly worry about what sea life may lie below? Art, life, water, they are all identical. Uh, the one who ascends to the summit is the victor. So he's using all those pretty words, but he's 
Basically saying people are like stepping stones. That's just like what he did to all those kids. Crushed them for his art. What a piece of shit. Uh, don't think we want to touch those tentacles. <laughs> yeah, I know what... Uh, where this is headed. Is it me or stream froze? Uh, might be you? I don't know. OBS tells me we are still live, but I don't know. Let me know. Are there no longer any uh, empty frames at this point? I bet there's a new path uh, again, so let's get in there and check it out. Uh, I'm assuming I want to go down this way. This will take me to the right one. Oh, I guess we're going through the tentacles. Is that an octopus? It's pretty damn big. Do you think it's safe for us to approach it? Should be fine. What the heck? Oh, what the heck? Are we not good, Rex? <laughs> or are talking about the tentacles? I guess it is just a painting after all. I'm sure it'll be okay. Uh-oh. No! Ooh, uh, uh, uh. Hmm, that was a valiant effort. Oh no, crap! Joker enemies! That sucks. At the same time, I've been wanting to fight something. I think we were supposed to. Get knocked out by the paintings. Uh, th oops, this is weak against this. Bringer of Misfortune. Yeah, unfortunately, we're still not high enough level to negotiate and or try to capture it, so. We shall just kill it. She's a. Uh, Chisa? Chisa! Don't think it's dead yet. I think we usually should be able to shock it to death. No, I don't think he does enough damage, actually. Oh, I did shock it though. Nice. Okay, finish it! Oh, it didn't die. Uh, no, we're killing it. Is work still going pretty fine for you, Rex? Ooh. Level up. Oh, that resists Dizzy. Uh, do I want this? Uh, decreased chance of being confused. Being dizzy. Uh, I think I'll get rid of this. I don't really want this. Increased defense. Nice. And that's the last move I can learn from. Or for him. How do I get out of here? Oh, right here. Not right here. Okay, so I'm not supposed to get knocked down. Oops. Hmm. So no tentacles. Let's we go back into the gate. Oh, maybe we have to turn off one of these. Turn this one off? I can't turn it off. Uh. Oh, there's a thing up here. How do I get up there? See, there's a thing up there. See, there's a point up there. I don't know how to get up there. No tentacles. One thing I could think of was to use a grappling hook, but I don't have one of those. Like, I don't have an anchor point.
Oh, there we go. Got it. Nice. Beauty is merely a mirage. Transforming that into money is what brings about true happiness. My fine mansion, my lifestyle among the chosen few, those things are the true art. So running your atelier uh, out of a shabby, rundown shack was simply an act after all. How foolish I was to have been deceived for so long. Fox. It's okay. We just never know. Don't know who people are until they reveal their true self. Sweet, this has got to be the end. How despicable. We have encountered so many of his paintings, yet not once did he mention a love for art. These are no paintings. They are just meaningless self-exertions placed into picture frames. I'm excited to see how the change of heart alters him. Now, let's hurry. Wreck his day. Oh. Dang it. <laughs> you got me, you got me. Swims. Uh, I think we're just gonna get more experience for our Jack Frost. Maybe we should get it for that plant guy. No, the plant guy's gonna die. Never mind. Take it back. Too much damage. Uh, this one's full. Speaking of Jack Frost. Oh, never mind. Let me your power. Or maybe I'll do this one. Let me your power. <laughs> so the best thing to do is just to level up the persona as much as possible so that we can fuse it away. Then eventually we can get more moves when we fuse. Oh, which one's this guy? Oh, this guy again. Chisa. 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 Oh, my Lord. It's funny, that seems to happen a lot. <laughs> like, they target Morna. And almost kill him. <laughs> nice, more armor, which I don't really need. Uh, need to heal him. Chest. Yana. Isn't that a uh, Amos item? I don't remember. Oh, I need to try to capture the cat. So we can fire. That was level 20, though. I can't. Darn it.
More experience, please. Fights levels up to get Agi. So hopefully I get that soon. Yeah, I do. Nice. Evil touch. It's evil. Intense focus. Strength is magic attack skills target one foe by 20%. Nice. That's pretty good magic stat too, 13. For this stage in the game. Oh, it's one of you. Uh, we don't have her anymore, I don't think. I think we... No, we tried to fuse for her, but she ended up being something else. <laughs> and I was a little sad. I remember that. Uh, we... Let's do fire. Oh, no! Let's do fire. So that means we can ice then. Usually. That's usually how it works. Oh, well. Oh, can't catch her now. No, I just finish her. Finish her. That's pretty good experience. Probably is just one enemy. She was supposed to be fairly strong. Sup, yarn. Is there like a lower level or something? Oh, there's events. Oh, what? I didn't even notice that there was a hook point right there. Uh, well, that's where I'm supposed to go. Whoops. <laughs> that's how I get back up then. Oh, it's a will seed. How do I get in there? You cannot proceed like this. Probably a button somewhere where it's very concealed. It's over here. Yeah, it is. I actually forgot that there's will seeds <laughs> that I'm supposed to be trying to get. Get this will seed. I got the green one. Is there a map button? Let's see the overall map. Shit, what the hell is up with this place? There's so much gold, it's hurting my eyes. The distortion is really bad here. It's barely holding up. Plus, it's not even on our map. Oh, really? But you must ascertain the truth through our eyes alone. Sash. Oh, I can't go that way. <laughs> I really thought I could. Oh. Uh, let's see if this way goes anywhere. The chest. Black rock. What's that do? Black rock. Stone able to transform into various equipment. A what? Not sure about that. Uh, I'll wait till this guy comes back around. I wonder who I would give it to to transform it. Oh, these guys. I should try to catch them.
まぶふー。Uh, actually, let me just kill him. I wanted to register my one persona before I get any, any new ones and guard it. I need to get to a safe room. Let's rip that open. I thought I'd seen everything there was to see in this disordered world, but to think it would conjure up such a bizarre place. So, like, which way are we supposed to go? I didn't see any other ways forward, did you? Are? Huh? What's this? Watch out! Whoa, part of the wall was peeling, so I pulled it off! That wasn't an actual wall? I see, so it was camouflage. So you may have been trapped here for eternity had you not noticed that. <laughs> Nice work, Skull. You did it. Uh, sure. You know, I just got lucky, right? <laughs> there might be more walls like this up ahead. Let's keep an eye out. And yeah, next time we get to a save point, I will go back to the Velvet Room. It seems a path beyond these apertures are distorted in the same way as this room. It's a treasure right here. Bad sculpture. Oh, that's where there's two Sayuris. Sayuris. Huh? Why is this painting here? It's probably some kind of illusion. We're in a palace after all. Well, I guess the painting itself might be correct, though. You say correct, but uh, aren't they all counterfeit? Although, maybe the real one's here, too. I wonder. Either way, the fact that this is here might mean it's connected to this space in some way. This painting, is it the Sayuri? Isn't that a fake? I mean, this is Madarami's palace. There's an obvious difference if you look closely. It shouldn't be too difficult to tell them apart. It's blue instead <laughs> of red. Yeah, maybe it's obvious for you. Uh, what do you think, Joker? It's a fake. Indeed, this is a fake. The real Sayuri is cloaked in vibrant crimson garments. Oh, right. Now that you mention it. Some fools would pay a fortune and would never know it's a fake. But you are quite impressive, Joker. I'm thinking I might be one of them fools. <laughs> Granted, I don't remember if Ryuji actually saw the real one before. I know Anne did. At least in that closet. You know it is counterfeit. No. Is it real? It's... Technically still fake, but we can guess it's the real. I think you have quite the eye for detail, Joker. For real? That's amazing. The vibrant crimson clothes, her beautiful hair, the sublime balance between subject and background. This may only be an illusion, but it is without a doubt a splitting image of the true Sayuri. Not even. Oh. Oh, so that's the real way. What the? It blew away. So I'm guessing if I went down there, it will reset my position. Nah, I kind of don't want to test it, but at the same time, it might be treasure. Okay, good. <laughs> okay. I was just curious. So I wanted to see if there was treasure. Oh. Yes. Oh, isn't this somewhere new? Seeing past the false image has opened a path to the truth. Mm -hmm. This golden place filled with counterfeit work is a prime example of the alchemy of Madarami's brain. In here, just as in reality, he entraps those who cannot see through his lying facade. You might be right. No wonder the distortion is so strong here. No. Hey, so uh, what does that mean? Uh, I think it means uh, finding the real Sayuri should break through the distortion and open a path. Mm, so we gotta check all, or check all of them? Why would we do that? Uh, let's just look for the real one, uh, assuming we can differentiate it. No. Uh, what do you think of this painting? Uh, I think it's a fake. Because it's supposed to have trees in the back, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the trees over there. No. <laughs> Is there something up with that wall? Alright, let's take a closer look. Holds the treasure. 
So there was a hidden room here. I am actually out of lockpicks, fortunately, so hopefully there's no more locks. Oh, here's a real one. It's the trees. Yes, this is the true Sayuri. It may be an illusion, but there are, can be no mistaking its allure. Nicely done. Nice. Nice indeed. Oh. I'd like a save room, please. No. Uh, yeah. Porker. Oh, what? <laughs> no! Wait, what's... Oh, shit! I was just... Can pay attention? Uh-oh. You think this will work on me? Hopefully Anne goes first, so we can dispel all this foolishness. Oh yeah, she does. Get that shit out of here. Uh... Pretty sure they absorb. Or something. Resist it. Uh, Mabufu! Oh yeah! Nice! That's the power of Takaja. Cork Bark. I'm sorry, I forget what the real one looks like. It's this one. What was the other one missing? The letters? Problem? No. Hmm. Not sure what is fake about that one. Maybe it's the sparkling shine? I don't know. It's behind here. Oh, it's the real one. I can't tell. Oh, the hair. Wow. It's a very subtle detail. It's crazy. No. <laughs> I love how they asked Joker <laughs> if it's the real one when Yusuke <laughs> knows. All the versions on display were fakes while the real one was hidden the whole time. Oh, what? <laughs> Where the shit <laughs> did it fly off to? Where the shit? I guess it. Oh, down there. Ugh, God damn it! What the hell is going on here? We have seen all the false images. Something must have changed somewhere. Yeah, that path down there. Going. Wait, is there something this way? Treasure! Yay! Just be careful, okay? The distortion is growing much stronger the deeper we go. Oh. Blank card, ooh! Can we... Or what can we do with the blank card, actually? Wait, where do we... Where do we go to use the card? Maybe they don't tell us till later. Way up to the treasure room yet? Yep, there it is. Ah, that is. Just as I expected. Modern Robin. I love how he's standing next to his own treasure. Then is the treasure behind him? Kinda of hard to tell from here. Uh, let's get a closer look. So I want to. I guess I have to get closer. あそこか。There it is. Yahoo. 
どんな姿だろうなさてな自画像とかじゃねえのまだらめの現実をここまで歪ませた根源か。So, what now? They get safe to say we got our roots set? Oh, yeah. Because we actually don't have access to the room yet. Oh, especially when there's lasers everywhere. Yeah, the lasers. The lasers. For some way through, it'll be difficult. Check this floor. Oh, the will see doors? It's one of the doors. Oh, it's the safe room. Alright. Mm, let's in. go back to. We'll go back to the velvet room. I just need one more will seed. Register. Pretty sure I still don't have. Yeah, not even close. <laughs> even that first one. The flowers. Oh, let's do it by result. Oh, yeah, we can get Matador now. We're level 17. Hermit lovers. Oh yeah, again, I meant to try to get this, but I was bamboozled. Justice. Suzaku. Oh yeah, this guy, Suzaku. I pick it. She's uh, she's just so good. I feel like it's always good to have Shisa. Honestly, though, it's just the moves that they have that makes it good or bad. Because you know, once we can knock them all down and all out attack, it's a wrap. Or a bus. Oh yeah, this guy. This creepy horse thing. I like it. <laughs> Kinda wanna get it. It requires Bareth and Regent. I don't know if I'm ready to get rid of. Bareth also makes this Archangel, which I actually don't really care for. Um, yeah, I don't really care for it. I think I should fuse up, because if I really want these lower level ones, I can go back to Mementos and try to, you know, catch things that I don't have. And honestly, maybe I should do that. I feel like these lower level ones, I should definitely just catch them later, slash... I can catch, you know, some of them in this particular dungeon, but... Yeah, for the ones that... Whoa! Interesting little... Paper dog or box, paper box. Hmm. Oh, this thing. Repel wind. This is very good. <laughs> I'm not gonna take it, but just good tank persona. Uh, again, let's just fuse up. Oh, should I save for this? <laughs> oh, it's this guy. I should save up for that guy. Yeah, I don't really need the Nako Mata. Hmm. Uh, I kind of want this though. I mean, I can just pull out another Regent, like 4K, and I've come to realize I shouldn't really buy new gear. Though I might have to buy it for Morgana since uh, the gear we get from the city armors won't fit <laughs> Morgana, so I think we just have to buy armor for Morgana. But everybody else though, we can just wash the city armor. Um, 
So we'll definitely get that, but for now, we can get this first. Barakunda. Well, that's really good. Really good. Uh, skillful combo. Nope, not that. Definitely this one, I think. Mighty Gaze is probably better since I'm gonna have a lot of AoE attacks. Increase technical. Increase damage from attacks that targets weaknesses, which is ice. Yeah, it's okay. I think the Mighty Gaze would be the best. Uh, I think I said I was gonna get all the other elements. Because I don't have them. So those two for sure. And then do I want all this other stuff? Dodge fire, don't need. Don't need this since we're about to get Marakunda. And then those I don't really care for. Uh, maybe I should get Light and Dark. I think it's so many moves. Please don't screw me over. Thank you. <laughs> no chainsaw this time. No chainsaw. <laughs> it's so creepy. Me, oh robots. I'll become your mask and show you the truth of the future you want. It's so creepy. Behold the hero font confidant. Oh yeah. Ooh, fire break is at level 20. That's pretty soon. Not that I really need it, but it's nice. Um, Suzaku. Do I want this one? Kunda is pretty nice. Drains fire. I don't have the sun social links, so maybe not. Hypixie. I kind of want to get Hypixie. Squeak against multiple things though, so that might not be good. We got all this good stuff <laughs> from Jack Frost. I don't think I have a Temperance, such link. Uh, I think I'll go for Death. Oh, I don't want to waste my orb. A robust I just got. We'll definitely get Mopsy. So much stuff. I'm gonna grab that Growth one for sure. Double Fangs. Chance to confuse. Oh, my Frey isn't inheritable. Or what? I can't get either. For whatever reason. Or maybe because. No. I was going to say maybe because Matador can't be compatible with uh, nuclear. But no, that's not how that works, I don't think. I don't know. Um. Let's just go for it. Mighty Gaze. Skills target all foes, which is probably what I have. This makes no sense. And decreases SP cost of nuke skills by half. Oh, because I'm getting it from um, she, so that's right. I was going to say, like, <laughs> I can't even get nuke skills. Uh, probably Mighty Gaze. Otherwise, increases effect period of support skills cast on allies. I feel like potent hy uh, hypnosis would be good for if you have an AOE uh, stat buff or whatever. Uh, so Mighty Gaze would probably be it. Uh, we already have Map C, about to learn. Do we need light? Definitely want growth. Maybe we should get these resistances. I uh, don't think it has that high of. Strength. We have somebody with Makoha. Maybe I should bring Buku since we're losing. Are oh, we losing Jack Frost in this? 
I don't remember. So I still might want single target. Otherwise, yeah, I think I might want a single target skill. Don't screw me over. No chainsaw. Oh, you're good. <laughs> I'm already traumatized by the chainsaw or whatever. Having a fusion go wrong. I match to This body of mine, born from the bloody throes of battle, shall be with you as a mask from now on. Alright. Ooh, look at that. Agility. 18. Ooh, double shots coming. Double shots. Mm, Sudama. Oh, this little guy. <laughs> Looks so dinky. Um, yeah, I don't think I want to fuse anything else. Since I don't, especially since I don't have the uh, social links. I could make this, but I am going to lose my matador I just made. <laughs> That'd be silly. Hysterical slap. Chance of rage. Stars 2% of match HP. Yeah, I think we're good. Pretty sure this is build out. Yeah. Uh, I do want to pull out something. I actually don't remember what I have. Uh, let me look at my list. I don't remember what personas I have. So I didn't use Jack Frost. I want to pull out Shisa, I think, and that's it. Yeah, I think I just want Shisa for the nuclear damage. Let's double check. So we got Ice. We got whatever this would be. <laughs> Oh yeah, this mixed with Regent will be a Persona I want. This is kind of just here for fun. I'll eventually get rid of this guy, probably. Same with this guy. font. Oh yeah, I don't need the... What's the name again? Barith? Because I have this guy now for a hero font. So we got fire, wind, electricity, psychic. We just need... There's ice. Yeah, so we just need Shisa. That's it. So let me pull that guy out, and we can head on our way. She's uh... Yeah, 5k is nothing. I'm rich! Yeah, I'm pretty sure this playthrough I'm going to be pretty rich, because I'm not going to be buying, again, uh, weapons and armor. Except for maybe just for... Um... Morgana. Alright, let's go back to the main hall, save. Yeah, I'm actually going to take a quick restroom break. So give me a little bit and I'll be right back.
Alright. Back. We just got a little more to do before we uh, secure our route to Marame. Or oh, there might have been treasure. Yeah. <laughs> I just ran by. But yeah, this playthrough I'm definitely going to be a lot more rich <laughs> than in previous playthroughs. Because, yeah, I'm planning not to spend so much on weapons and armor. Oh, a control room. I think we can turn the la them lasers off here. Yep. That probably needs a passcode, though, right? Oh, we don't need a passcode. Uh, open the shutters. Can we just do all of these things? Uh, just turn it all off. Ah, <laughs> what's the meaning of this? Uh, I'm not sure. It seems we have lost power. The backup generator should bring it up again in no time. Oh, what a nasty surprise. Hmm, could this also be... Hey, someone! It came back on pretty damn fast. Yes, and the infrared lasers remained active even during the power outage. So we'll only be able to turn the power off in there for a few seconds. Wait a second. Aren't those guards that just ran out headed this way? What else should we try? We might be in trouble if we don't hurry. Turn off the lasers. Huh? Nothing happened. Error. Orni Lord Madarame can access this terminal due to maximum security protocol. The heck? There was no point in even coming here then. Hmm, it seems disabling the infrared ra la uh, the lasers is not within the realm of possibility for us. Oh no. Mm hmm? So you're the ones who tampered with the electricity. Crap, we got company. Oh, it's this wolf guy. Uh, I should have looked at his weakness, because I don't remember. <laughs> it's probably ice. Oh, it's a lot of them. I'll just test them all, though, for fun. Pretty sure it was ice. All of them's burned. Nuclear! It's great! Ow, ow. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. It's probably ice. It's not ice. Oh, we don't have. Hey, we here. Uh, let's kill this guy. Oh. Oh. Miss. Uh, let's try heal. Once he gets back to Morgana, I'll heal. Uh, this might kill everybody, though. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, we can go back and um, make that one guy. One persona. That was a surprise. All we really managed to do was open, all, uh, open the uh, shutters. On top of that, we can only turn the lights off briefly while the lasers remain unaffected. Oh well, uh, I guess we just gotta see what's past those shutters. That's locked. Click, click, click. <laughs> uh, wait. Auto recover. Oh, and it's out of power or SP. All right, let's go fuse that last persona I wanted. It's like slime and regent. The slime and regent? It was slime and something. I think it was slime and regent. So let's pull out a regent. Uh, pull out. Pull out regent. Persona. So I'm guessing there's no way to actually level up the regent, huh? Uh, 
本当にいいのですね終わりですかおっさあ、ゲームを探りましょう。もう、like、スライムのリジェント。おや、つけたペーパーガー。やあ。なるほど。ペーパーガー。ああ。おお、あいつ、ペーパーストロングフィジカル。なあ、わんるいふ、ストロング。ああ、ブース、ああ、ガンダメージ。シーン、ダブルショット。Um, but yeah. What do I want? Increases damage after baton pass. Do I want to use AoE magic on everything? Increases chance of being inflicted by status elements, which might be a good thing, actually. Increases technical damage. Increases cost of side damage in half. Maybe this, because this is kind of like a tanky thing. Has a lot of resistances, or like null things. So it's actually good against、uh, Hama and Mudo skills. Yeah, I don't think I want that. Yeah, let's do this.、Um, this. Kind of sucks. We do learn Mapsy. Do you want these? I guess we could get a element. Maybe we just dodge fire. Maybe we just gain more、uh, defensive things. Because I don't really need, again, more elements. I just use a different persona that has elements, chiefly the Oro boss. I kind of want to get lunch, but、hmm, it's too weak. Let's just get this. Don't chainsaw me, girl. Good. <laughs> It's interesting because, like, in the past, I don't think I really spent too much time in the fusion thing. But now that we're here, I do a lot.、Uh, you have that mask in your heart. That means you might be here. You might be here. Nice. Mapsy. Oh! I forgot to look at what else we were gonna get. Oh, what's this? Oh, yeah, Kinsey will be good later on. Is this lovers? It is lovers. Nice. Oh, yeah, isn't this the yeah, little guy? She's a.、Uh... Oh, yeah. We just fought these guys. Uh, yeah, I think we're good. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't get Frey. So I need one of these with Frey. And then we get the next thing. That's okay, though. What do we have? Magician, Moon, Counselor, Hero Font. We're missing a lever, so eventually I will need it for Anne. I can just pull it out. When、that time comes. Wait, 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 I need to register. I think. Nope, I take it back. Alright. I need to get the last will seed and also secure the path.、Uh, maybe I should switch Anne out now that she's out of SP pretty much. Everyone else is pretty good. Also, make sure Yusuke has stuff. I did just pick that up, which is nice. Replica assault rifle. Jesus. I think I should. Oh, never mind. Maybe I should bring this. Frey was actually pretty good. Maybe that's better than Garu right now. Have any extra outfits right now? Alright, save again. Let's go.
Alright, which way are we going? I think it's this way. They opened up the shutters. Oh, it's one of you guys. Girls. I don't remember what her weakness is. Uh, it's not window. Well, it could be. Just... Little target. Oh, I forgot I don't have AoE. Ice. I'm gonna do it again. This might kill everything. It... It didn't, but everything's too weak to withstand <laughs> anything. Oh, it might be ice. It's not ice. Not sure what's weak against them. The lady. I'll definitely try to catch it next time I counter it. I hear all that sparkly business. Please doesn't require lockpick because I don't have any. I don't have any. Oh, we do have one. Ooh, lucky. Lucky. That's that extra one I crafted, actually. Ooh, Zen outfit. Morgana really needs a new thing. Oh, uh, it's, it's not that good. Meaning, defense wise, it's not that good. Oh, this one's better, though. Nice. Oh, where are we? One just will take me to a wheel seed. Oh nice, it was actually a uh, dead end this way. Oh, safe room. I didn't realize it was safe room here. Yeah, those safe rooms are pretty close to each other. I'll take it though. That's how we're going to... And drop into the treasure chest, I think. Oh, it's this guy again. Is he level 20? Yeah, I can't catch it. Oh. Mm, the wolf. Wolf for box. This one's weak against wind. Yeah, maybe it's weak against electricity. Oh yeah, it is. Headbutt. Do you have a single target fire? Oh yeah, I do. Omoraki. Uh, I should probably try to catch one of these. Uh, let's do this one, I guess. They're about the same. I didn't realize it tells us to type at the top. Damn it. Let me your power. 
<laughs> Try calming his nerves. We thought you not from around here, you human. Why you come all the way here? We're girls, I just felt like it. Uh, timid. So not serious answers will work. Ah, maybe not. <laughs> Humans who have no goals should rot. You made me afraid of dying now. All of a sudden, you can laugh at me if you want. And you had something you lost and you not know how important it is until after it's gone right. Uh... My ex-girlfriend. You understand what it's like to have love and loss, alright. Nice. Somehow I salvaged that. <laughs> Nice. Oh, what? <laughs> what? I just want the chest. <laughs> that was silly. Snuff soul. Um, what is that? Will seed. I don't know why that window. Oh, what? Uh, we can try to catch the other guy now. This guy. Uh, raging temper. Uh, let's do this. Let's try to catch the other wolf. Or yeah, I think they're both wolves. Gloomy. Don't say anything too forceful. This territory ours. Why you keep trampling here? Don't say anything too forceful. I'm sorry. Oh, what? That's not forceful? You laugh at me if you want. You had something you lost now. Blah, blah, blah. Don't say anything too forceful. My pal who switched schools. Ah. Bad choice. Made no sense. Well, I guess we're just gonna kill you then. Giant slice. Nah, it's not waste. Oh. Oh, what? I probably knew that. Meaning I could have. Because I have all its weaknesses. Dang it. Oh well. Oh, well. Let's try this again. Hopefully he doesn't kill it. Good chance he'll die. Oh, he didn't die. Nice. Let's try this again. Yeah, easy on it. Go easy on it. Me not understanding in what way you superior to me. But youthfulness wasn't quite the right answer. Your victory pretty much assured, so let me ask you a deep question. Your wishes you not can let go of, even after you die. I won't die. Everyone's happiness. He didn't like that. I think mean, that's another, like, mid-answer. Mm, I won't die. I won't die? <laughs> Not quite satisfied. That's unfortunate. I do hear the will seed though. Loud in my ears. Got a scary room too. Oh, it's most likely where all the mechanisms in the exhibition hall are controlled from. Given the number of hanging works, it would be make sense to have a room dedicated to controlling them. The observational skills of an artist are out of this world. Hmm. 
Hmm, do you think uh, this moves the wires for all the hanging art? Looks like the fox's deduction was on point. So I hear the wheel seats like right there, but can't really get to it right now. What's up? That's just a window. <laughs> it's a regular window. Oh. Hey, ain't this right above the treasure? Look, those are there aren't any lasers above it. This is quite a large hole in their security, but what do we do? Jump down to retrieve it? We won't be able to get back out if uh, we did that, though. Look up. Cha-cha. Rain with a hook. Didn't we see something earlier that looked like it could be a set of controls for their crane? Let's go back and check it out. What about the wheel seed, though? It's like right underneath us. Well, I don't know how to get down there. Yeah, it looks like this is it. Joker, give it a try. Yeah. Stop, stop. Don't notice if you keep that up. Get back up there. Go, 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 go. <laughs> hmm, this could be useful. Uh, do you plan on standing on that hook? Uh, would they not spot you the moment you were lowered down? No, not necessarily. There's something I can do to make sure that doesn't happen. Bait the guards away? Exactly. That's where Skull comes in. Oh, why me? Actually, he'd probably screw it up somehow. Uh, why don't we try to think of some other way? You only brought me up so you could make fun of me? Stupid cat. Alright, uh, we were able to turn the lights off over in that other control room. Oh yeah. Only for a few seconds though. Uh, there would not be enough time to make it all the way there, or here. That's so why we're going to split up the task and work together to pull off this heist. One person will shut the power off here, the other person... We'll lower the crane and I'll grab the treasure. You sure that's gonna work? Seems like they'll realize what's going on at some point. <laughs> Sometimes bold moves have the greatest payout, unless someone has a better idea. Uh, sounds a good plan to me. Well said, Joker. You understand what being a phantom thief really means. Alright, it's settled. Our infiltration route is secured. Gotta be kidding me. Now then, it's time for the calling card. Nice. Uh, first though, we need to get this will seed. That's like right there, but not right there. How do we get to it? It's right below us. Yeah, I think I was able to get to it, but I kind of skipped where I was supposed to go. So let's go back and find it. Oh yeah, it's over here. Oh, there's a person hiding, or not hiding, but guarding it. What the? They got shadows here too? I could build a seat past this door. It might be a pain to get our hands on it though. Nah, we got it. Just... Let me get this. Uh, I think we can just go straight in to the fight. Uh, that one's gonna be tough. You guys ready? Let's go. Oh, did you all... Know what? It doesn't even matter. Now that you've seen this place, you won't be leaving alive. <laughs> oh, this thing. Uh, this room will only be our, uh, your end. We'll be passing through. <laughs> Uh, quite sure what's weak against. I feel like it, it's a nuclear type. So it's probably weak against Psy. I'm assuming it's not weak against any of the elements we have in our party. Like, oh! So yeah, it's weak against nuclear. Nice. Hell yeah. Oh, I'm dying. Please don't kill me. Don't kill me. Oh, 
Uh-oh. No, why? That's not good. And we're definitely gonna have to do this. Oh, I'm I was not paying attention. I don't know what it used against me to almost wreck me. Uh, <laughs> awakened God. I uh, feel like I should just attack it again. I can't baton pass for some reason. Oh, because I'm dizzy? That dizzy? I have no idea. Brain Jack. Oh, that. No! That's not good. I'm actually scared. <laughs> mm, I'm scared. Let's do this. This reduces its attack. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's all out attack this guy. Ooh, 129, not bad. Also, that's what he used. Ah! Don't kill Mona. Uh, why'd you use... This? Shine this Japple. Full of resource HP of all allies. I think I do need that right now. Let's do it. Yeah, I'm trying to be, like, less frugal with my items. A lot of times I would not use items. <laughs> Even though I really should. Uh, let us decrease defense. We need to whack this guy a lot harder. Should be closer to 200 damage, right? Since we have everybody on board. Oh, way past 200. Oh, maybe not way past, but... Oh yeah, blocked, baby. Uh, let's keep healing. Actually, uh, I don't need to do that. I think dizziness reduces your accuracy by a lot. Yeah, <laughs> can't see straight. Um, have you scale? Have his damage increased? Uh, and let's. Get Shisa out. I know I have you somewhere. There you go. Oh, it's so weak against Sai, though. That's not worth it. Not worth it. Don't want to die. Yep, not worth it. Uh, what do I want to do, then? Maybe decrease act. Yeah, let's do this. I forget that's usually the thing. Uh, Psy and Nuclear are opposites of each other. Or whatever. Alright, finish it! Nice. It didn't die! I forgot because uh, Mona is not... Not part of the attack. Oh, it's weak against wind. Oh my gosh, this whole time I didn't know. <laughs> it's because I was too afraid to check. Oh, well, it's all good. We got it. Nice. Oh. Does um people not in our party also get experience, even though they're not, like I said, in our, in our party? Nice. That's definitely... I don't know if it's a change, but it's definitely... Nice. <laughs> nice, we got all three now. So we get... Should be getting a new accessory. Wow, 
wah, wah. Wonder what this is gonna be. Is it the it'd be nice if it's revive? Crystal of Vanity. Let's see what it does. Crystal of Vanity. Oh, I was like, what does that do? Nullifies weaknesses. Ooh. That's really good. That's, hell yeah. That's like an overpowered item. What the heck? <laughs> Alright, let's save. I can probably grind a little bit more. I still have a lot of SP with some of my characters. So we can do a couple laps before we head out. down I wish we just bust in there and just fight everybody but it's too much what if this resets the enemies uh not quite I might have to We'll see. Might just straight up teleport elsewhere. Nope, they did. Oh, this is the one I can catch the uh I have no idea what how to pronounce the name. <laughs> it's Azu I don't know. That lady. <laughs> uh let's just kill this guy. Oh, that's not going to kill everybody. Oh, it didn't kill everybody. But she's too strong. Can I heal her? I can't heal her. Dang it. I want to catch her, but... I have no way of knocking her down anyways. Oh, there we go. Join us! <laughs> that's one way of capturing. Join us! Nice. It's the start of a long relationship. Um, I think I was going to get rid of this one. Because that's like the extra. Well, actually, these two. I don't think it really matters. Because either one... Yeah, let's get rid of this one. I think from here on out, we're just going to... Ooh. Jack Frost leveled up. Yes. We're just gonna keep uh, grinding, just getting experience, leveling up. That's pretty funny. If I just kept going this way, I would have got to the will seed. But I decided to explore the other places first. Don't remember if there was enemies on this side of the. Oh, there is. There should be one right here. This should be the, all the foxes. Man, that guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, just straight up died. <laughs> I was not ready for that. That's pretty good experience. Uh, let me check the experience of everybody. Maybe it's just a waste of time. Might take too long to level up anyways. 
Yeah, <laughs> it's like in the thousands of experience I need. All right, we can just leave. Yeah, it's not waste too much time. I'm not 100% sure if I'm like, you know, over leveled, but I guess there's no point of grinding extra. Yes. Uh, <laughs> what am I doing? We're leaving, that's what we're doing. I'll save here and then I'll leave. Oh. Oh, what's happening? You seem to be doing well, inmate. Oh, what? You have an important matter. Oh, it's part of the cards. Yeah, 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 yeah. You see how she waits until we secure the treasure routes or whatever before telling us about the skill cards. Uh, there you are, inmate. Special ritual. Oh! The electric chair used to sacrifice personas and transmute them into high level items. Interesting. I don't know if I remember that from the original. I remember you can, like, put your personas in, like, a daycare <laughs> or whatever. They will continuously level on their own. Right, let's check out this. <laughs> Itemized persona. Ooh. Wow. Uh, this ritual lets you sacrifice personas and choose me them into high level items. You lose a persona, but you'll get things that like useful weapons and accessories. We'll record the transmutation result of each persona in the inmate registry. You'd better be grateful. Each time you make a sacrifice, you need to use a special material with a potential. Oh, for item transmutation. Gotcha. I do have the thing for this. Uh, you probably have no idea what it is, so take this one and get clued in. You better show your gratitude for it. You should be able to find them in your own reality, too, not just the other one. Uh, do your best to find them. Yeah, see all these black items or weapons. Nice. Um, Red Blood Capote. Not available, assuming like, because I don't have like a black male armor piece that I can like fuse this into. Ooh, plus five strength. Holy crap, that's pretty good. That's really good. I don't have a black robe. I do have a blank card. Yeah, I probably won't do this right now. Scratch. I do have a black rock. Nice. Oh. Oh, if only I had this for Morgana, that would have been perfect. 1 ESP, that's pretty good. Allows you to learn the gun skill double shot. So I'm pretty sure I have to... Well, I don't have to, but... I can make a... Ray skill card. At some point. And that's what I would... Do and then give it to the lover's lady that I have. Compare. Yeah, definitely just do that. Uh, but yeah, I don't really have anything I can do right now. Uh, I want to go back. Something wrong. You appear to be lost in thought. Excellent. No problems all around. Shall we get going? 
Uh, let's save. So I probably don't have time to actually do the Madarame calling card and all that jazz, so... We can just uh, waste some time for a little bit and then I'll probably head out for the day. Dang, <laughs> we did so much. Finally secured our route to the treasure. All we need to do now is send the calling card. Okay, I've been waiting for this. Anyways, uh, when are we gonna send it? I guess that part's up to you, dude. Let us know when you need us. You know, I forgot that if I was gonna grind, that uh, I'm pretty sure if I put it onto easier difficulty, it allows me to get more experience per fight. I haven't tested it yet. I can probably just search Google. It'll tell me. I'll probably do that in a little bit. Uh, all we have to do now is send the calling card to Madarame. All right, it's finally time. But all we gotta do is decide when we're gonna do it. And shouldn't we talk to Yusuke about this first? Or that first? Uh, why? I mean, Madarame was his teacher. It's not our place to decide something like this. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's talk to Yusuke. Yeah, the bigger- or the problem's bigger than just the three of us. Anyway, uh, how about we all meet up at the hideout? Yep, sounds good. Okay, let me know when you want to meet up and I'll tell Yusuke. Yeah, but you can't hang out with... Uh... Sojuro today. Uh, I think we're just gonna study some more. Actually, let me see if I can make more lockpicks. I don't need them right now, obviously, but... Let's see if I can get it or not. Let's see if I can make three. We can only, oh, we can make all three. Uh, let's do that then. More lockpicks, please. Make it. Do it. Nice. Mm, you ended up with even more than I had expected. Nice, we have four. You know, you'll definitely... Oh, you're definitely getting better. I can tell just by watching you. Still gonna take a while to level up, though. Oh yeah, we got extra proficiency for no reason. <laughs> well, it's mainly because we made that extra lockpick. Good stuff. Mm -hmm. Part kind of wants to go to Mementos. We'll see. Maybe I'll do some social link stuff first. I don't want to go to school. This sucks! <laughs> I'm so tired every day. Oh, me too. I don't want to go to work. Are there any breaks coming up? Oh yeah. Side effects? Oh yeah. We're gonna hang out with Dr. Death Lady. Have you had any side effects since then? Passed out at all? I'd like to check you out just in case. I don't have any patients. Could you stop by the clinic? I believe this is for some extra for funsies social link gain. So I don't think we necessarily will rank up. Or anything like that. Everyone, it's time to do some shopping. Oh, we got muscle, muscle, a muscle, muscle plus set. So a bunch of proteins looks like. Aki speed S. Actually, I think it's like um, uh, buffs in uh, not games, but um, in fights. So stronger is probably attack buff. Harder core is defense buff, and actually speed is of course accuracy and speed. What's the other one? Outdoors kit. Master the elements of fire, ice, and electricity. Oh, this is probably so we can do that type of, yeah, elemental damage. Low torch, dry ice, magneto coil. Yep, let's do that one. It's probably a lot better. So I think this is just for a single target, which I don't like. <laughs> Especially because I have a bunch of personas I can cast these things, so might as well do this one. That's, uh, other characters can use them as well. Let's fast forward. Alright, 
Um, going up town. Let's go. Try to think what else we can do. I don't think I want to hang out with Takemi, to be honest. But I might end up doing it because we can't hang out with anybody else. <laughs> uh, let's go to the air shop. Or air soft shop. That's how much my stuff and. I think I might go ahead and buy armor for. I don't have enough guts to do that, so. I'll do that yet. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure he's a social link, yeah. I just don't remember which social link he is. Oh, that's a lot of money. Do, 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 do. Go ahead and sell these. Get rid of these. Uh, I think I can keep that from Makoto. Oh, darn. I don't have a uh, fourth city armor. So I'm going to have to wait to do that. Then again, since these are male, I probably don't need it. So, yeah, let's not worry about that. Silver so, key ring. Go ahead and sell it. Chocolate choker. Let's keep those. All those. Uh, buy a protector for Morgana. I guess I can get this best one. It's not even that good. But again, I'm rich, so let's go ahead and get the best one. I wonder that we resist rage might be important. Well, it's too late, though. Let's go. Yep, sell this cat sweater. I don't really want anything. <laughs> See, the things that we got from the washer are already tons better than... Yeah, look at that. The best thing we can buy. So yeah, it's really no point of buying armor. Just gotta keep fighting the uh, strong enemies in each palace to get the sooty stuff. Pack. Bird boost. Freeze boost. Shock boost. You know. I should probably get one. For each element. Let's do that. Again, I'm rich, so it doesn't really matter. So I believe this gives 10% buff to that element. Uh, eventually, there's ones that will be amps. Like shock amp. Stuff like that. I think that's a 25% buff, which is pretty sizable. Anyways, I don't know how to get the uh, those black type items so we can use personas into them to make high level stuff. Uh, again, we do have a death persona, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I'm doing. Yep, we got Death, we have Hero Fonts, so we are covered for the main two. We have Chariot, and we have Lovers. We have everything. Yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and hang out with the Doctor, I guess. I said I wasn't going to, but at the same time, why not? There's nobody else to hang out with. Uh, the woman gets the stranger people act like that perverted high school teacher. Has anyone ever studied the correlation between the rise in temperature and the rise in weirdos? <laughs> you came because you saw my messages, right? Yep, I want to do a clinical trial. Actually, let's see if I can buy something real quick. What do you want? Uh, I want some revive. Oh, this to all allies is pretty good, though. I mean, I'm rich, so let me get like five of these. I uh, don't think there's any... Oh, there's that revive. Yeah, let's get like five of these. Only well, safe places. I have Patra and stuff to worry about these, so... Yep, I think I'm good. Those are pretty much emergency items. Need something again? 
onto that clinical trial. I refined the medicine from the other day a bit. Uh, could you come to the back? Yep. Oh, maybe we are able to rank up here. So I forget that she's on... Well, I don't know. I feel like Sundays, these type of hangouts don't necessarily result in a level up, but I guess it just depends on your social uh, rank. How close you are to leveling up. Yeah, let me whip out the social link guy. Oh, maybe not. Mm, here you go. The effect should be instant this time. But, oh. <laughs> Let's see. Eyes are focused. Look this way. One, two, three, four. Nothing yet, huh? Uh oh. Inside of my mouth <laughs> feels like it's burning. My nose is itchy. Itchy. Oh, there it is. The inhibitory effect is just as I hoped. A oh, what? Your weight was the primary reason it took longer to kick in than expected. Yes, this is what I expected from a teenager. Jeez. We're making great progress. Practice makes perfect, right? Okay, hold tight. Once I compile all the data, we can move on. Oh, what? Hello, the Kami Medical Clinic of Eternal Medicine. Or Internal Medicine, how can I help you? An emergency, huh? But we're not a designated hospital. Besides, the head physician here is Tai Takemi. Wait, is that her? Ah? Uh, awfully rude, just hanging up on a lady like that. Uh, well, thank you. Yeah, it doesn't look like... Anything. Oh, there it is. What is, what is that about? Ah, uh, he basically just called the wrong number. An ambulance driver was looking for a transfer location. All the designated hospitals are full. But to think they'd actually, or accidentally, call a general practitioner? Must have been a new paramedic. He seemed to at least know his, or my name though. Which is odd. I've been blacklisted by the larger medical community. They called me the plague, due to a grave medical error I made. Uh, what do you mean? Uh, this goes back to my old job. I used to work at a university hospital in the city. Uh, I was never actually convicted of anything, but I'm still considered a pariah in the medical industry. Does that scare you? Participating in clinical trials must run by a doctor. Or participating in clinical trials run by a doctor like that? Uh, I need the medicine. <laughs> need it. So then. <laughs> right, you're just a student preparing for his entrance exams. Uh, I guess we're both equally shady, hmm? Well, that's fine. Uh, being ostracized has enabled me to focus on my own research and development. <laughs> Regardless, I look forward to working with you. I'll be sure to add some medical medicine for you, my little guinea pig. <laughs> like my bond with Kemi is growing. As more healing arms to clinic, oh yeah. Yes. Sterilization medicine. Oh, jeez. All that. Hello, Dr. Takemi's Clinic of Internal Medicine. Huh? One of teriyaki chicken? Bruh. You're all good for today. <laughs> you can go now. Come again soon if you're still alive. I feel like cooperating in this that shady clinical trial has increased my guts. It's gonna take a while for me to... Level up my guts enough to talk to Yuami. Okay, take care. Hey, my little guinea pig. I have to talk to you about something. You haven't told anyone about my drugs, right? Of course not. Okay. I mean, part of the deal is that you're strictly prohibited from sharing anything that happens here, so... I guess I'll believe you. For now. Feels like I've been getting a lot more patients uh, asking for drugs lately. Wonder where they keep hearing about me. It's been really bugging me. But that's all I wanted to ask, I guess. Uh, okay, see you soon. <laughs> you're not spilling any secrets, are you? Yeah. Probably do a couple more days worth of... Social link stuff and then right head out. Yeah, don't forget to ask the airsoft guy about that paper bag. It's not like we have enough. 
uh, whatever to do that though. All right, Sojo, you're next. <laughs> uh, but I don't think we'll deepen. That's fine. I'll just hang out with him. So I don't think I'm doing anything else. There's nothing else. Oh, I could work at the beef bowl shop. Maybe I should do that. Maybe I should do that just to try to get my social link. Yeah, with this guy. Uh, not Big Bang Burger, but uh, there should be somebody here. Yeah, the street order. Uh, where is he? See if I can work. You can quickly travel to the beef bowl shop. Come to think of it, you applied for a part time job at this beef bowl shop, right? Working at the beef bowl shop will cause time to pass, but in addition to receiving money, your prayer efficiency will improve. Some days the shop will be more crowded than usual. During busier times, you will need to remember a lot of orders. Stay calm. If you can make it through the rush, uh, you may earn more money than usual. Nope, let's do it. Let's get to work, Al. Let's get to working. I put extra pressure on my ankles just now. Hey, look at that uniform. Oh, you're the new part-timer, right? I've been expecting you. No need to introduce yourself. I actually need you to start right away. <laughs> Do you have any questions about the job? Uh, what does the work entail? Take customers' orders, prep them, serve them, ring them up, and then clean the store. The meals are all ready-made, so it should be simple. Just make sure you're nice to the customers, okay? Anything else? Are there other employees? Not quite. Our budget's been cut despite being short-staffed, so uh, you'll have to do everything alone. Oh, Jesus. You're a spry young dude, right? You'll be fine. I'll pay you more to make up for the extra hard work. If only it was like that in real life. <laughs> I guess it depends on the company and stuff like that, but yeah, for the most part, no, you're just hourly. Uh, okay. I need to head off for a bit. Uh, keep an eye on the shop until I get back. Jeez, just doing everything almost at once. Or by yourself, I mean. This job is ludicrous. You have to do everything all by yourself from the very beginning. Oh well. Just give it your best shot, I guess. I'll be cheering you on. Oh, there's that politician guy. Hey, the meat's done. You'll burn it if you let it cook any longer. That customer there wants to order takeout. Who has, has the time to prepare that? I love how Morgan is just in the corner. Alright, good work. You can leave now since it's the end of your shift. This is your pay today. Thank you. Well, I hope you can keep it up. <laughs> That's like nothing. I make more money in Momentos. Or in the Metaverse. Yare, yare. I don't blame you for looking exhausted, uh, but you still manage all those orders by yourself. If you ask me, you're pretty proficient. Oh so, yeah. yeah. Still not enough to level up, but we're working on it. Oh yeah, punch that clock. <laughs> uh, let's leave. I guess we can't. Yeah, can't get the social link yet. Uh, yeah. I guess that's fine. I'm actually not entirely sure how to... Rank up. That was funny, because... So what he first said? You ride this uh, train at this time, too. He said that before. Uh, in a previous... Morning. I'm assuming, depending on where you are in the story, or like, you know, palace run, or even if you started doing palace stuff, um, you know, this dialogue would be different. So I thought that was pretty cool. Wait, is that it? So the girl in line, in like, the skirt and the blue... Whatever. It's not really she looks a little more detailed than everybody else, so I'm like, is that a character? Uh, we're not gonna send it yet. I'll probably wait for like a week. Let's just do like a week's worth of like uh, social link stuff. Because we have so much time. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm beefy enough to beat Madarame. Madarame, the maestro of the art world. Artists with that good eye of it, or good of an eye are rare in Japan. I wonder if he has synesthesia? What? 
Yes, regarding synesthesia, one of many English terms that come from Greek root words. Uh, haven't heard of it. It's a condition where your senses can cross over each other. Uh, like saying music as color. Oh yeah. There are all kinds of varieties though. In some sense combinations are more common than others. We call people who experience this uh, phenomenon synthesis. I already know if I said that right. <laughs> Definitely didn't say that right. Mr. Dream, and you were staring off into space, weren't you? While your number's up, the root words of synesthesia are sin and Aesthesis. <laughs> what? What do they mean? Uh, I might not know this one. She wants to know what the root words mean. It's all Greek to me, but I can give it a try. Okay, let's uh, think about this. It'll be easier if we put our heads together. Okay, so let's start with sin. I think uh, that's in a lot of other words too, like synergy, syn synchronicity, or synchronicity, and synthesis. Um. If we think about what these words have in common, uh, then maybe sin means together. Together. And that's it. Sin means together or a combination of something. And aesthesis, uh, that's a little like the word aesthetics. I wonder if it means senses, probably. Yeah, that's it. Sounds like we know the definition of the root words, so that means they're fully. Or the full word basically means that's it coming together. Yeah, that's it. Whew. We really gotta stay on our toes in this class. I could use a snack after all that brain power. Let's get a treat after this. Good. Good. You've been studying. Unfortunately, synesthesia is something you have to be born with. You can't learn it. I think that's true. Some of the geniuses over the course of history have had synesthesia. Composer Franz Liszt. I even as I want to. Uh, instructed his orchestra to play the color purple. The poet Arthur Rimbaud was also said to see colors in letters. He's pretty smart. I didn't expect that. He might not uh, be too bad. You're on a roll today. Hell yeah. Seeing colors and sounds and letters and feeling shapes and flavors and numbers. Geniuses and common people see the world differently. Were you able to understand that? Synesthesia, huh? It's fascinating. Although, the reason Madarame sees the world differently is because of his distorted desires. Alright, let's finish the day off and I guess we can head out for the day. Yeah, my research is going smoothly. Wait, do we still have a counselor persona? I think I'm really making progress with my research. Uh, all thanks to you, of course. So do you think you could drop by to give me some more insight today? Oh yeah, we can get closer, heck yeah. Uh, let's not do it yet though. Because we need to pull out a counselor persona. Oh, we do have a counselor persona, what? He didn't say anything about me having it or not. Uh, so yeah, I'll probably hang out with him. Yeah, let's not waste any time. I don't think there's anything else. I need to do. Oh, I didn't even read that first prompt <laughs> that says I have the counselor persona. Uh, yeah, so let's go see him. Uh, thank you, I really appreciate the help. How about we talk outside today? We can meet up in the courtyard, maybe. See you there. Let's pull out the counselor persona stuff. Special link. We got rank 3, right? Uh, rank 4, actually, wow. Uh, well, Dreamkun, I just found out how scary cats can be, despite their cuteness. Uh, where did this come from? <laughs> it's random. I'm on it. Oh, it happened on my way to school this morning. I spotted a kitten that had gotten itself stuck up in a tree. I tried rescuing it after, or since I felt bad for it, but ended up with the clawing of a lifetime for the effort. You know, we don't see any claws on this body. <laughs> I had no idea. A cat's claws are so sharp. Yep, they are definitely very sharp. I think it's because they're more paper thin than like sharp sharp. Though, you know, maybe a little bit of both. Uh, I know, right? <laughs> it's, it's Morgana. Speaking from experience, eh? It really does hurt a lot. Actually, I don't think Morgana ever clawed at. Joker. But I was able to rescue the kitten, so it was also worthwhile. All I really have to do is make sure to put antibiotics on the scratches anyway. Well, let's move on and talk about a different kind of pain. 
We discussed this for a bit last time we talked, actually. The pain felt within one's heart. Um, there are all sorts of ways to identify and diagnose physical injuries and illnesses. But when it comes to pains of the heart, we're working in unknown territory. There's so much we haven't learned yet. Treating trauma sure is different, or difficult, when it's invisible. Uh, if only we could somehow directly reduce emotional pain in a healthy way, like uh, putting antibiotics on a scratch. Is that what you're researching? Oh, how astute of you. As a matter of fact, you're not too far off the mark. Unfortunate as it may be, we all know there's no topical medicine that can properly hear a heartache. Uh, not only that, psychological issues are even more complex. Here, let me demonstrate. Oh, Dreamkun, woe is me! Oh, what? My heart is in such uh, pain, it's like I'm being pierced through the chest. <laughs> oh, what? I have such a torturous burning deep inside me. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was a poor attempt of acting. Uh, please don't look at me like that. But uh, basically, what I'm getting at is our own emotional pain is the only kind of, or the only kind we can fully comprehend. Uh, that seems obvious, right? Uh, but it's absolutely vital to understand. A person's heart, uh, their pain cannot be seen. Even if they spend their whole lives expressing it to others, there is no way for them to truly grasp it. Uh, it's not like we can directly look at their hearts and remove the uh, root causes of their pain. Uh, but for me to do any good at, or in that area, I need to conduct further research into the heart. More specifically, I need to learn how the heart reacts to the world around it. That's the first stepping stone to a breakthrough in the field. Once that's been figured out, we'll not only comprehend psychological pains that were once no unknowable, but uh, we'll even be able to perform more effective treatment for those people with wounded hearts. Uh, doesn't matter. You're so kind. <laughs> I'm no saint. I just do. I just want to do my job well. If we can get rid of people's pain, uh, that'll be for the best, right? I'm no fan of pain myself. Nah. On the other hand, uh, people have laughed off my idea as just a silly, pointless dream. I can't say I blame them. But still, you take the time to listen to what I have to say, and you actually try to understand. Thanks to you, I can tell I'm actually getting somewhere with my theories. How can I phrase it? Uh, I guess I could say you're making this hazy, hard-to-grasp idea finally appear before me? You know, you could very well become a counselor yourself someday. Say, would you like to try being my assistant? Of course, I'm on a shoestring budget, so I wouldn't be able to pay you. Uh, that sounds fun. Oh, surprisingly eager. Maybe you really will become a skilled counselor in the future. <laughs> Joking aside, I am truly grateful for your assistance. Thank you, Dream Coon. Yay. What for? Yes. Uh, let's put a pin in that for today, shall we? I hope you'll lend an ear again when you've got the time to spare. Now, I know you've been waiting for this, so let's get to that mental training. Let's get more SP. Yes. Yes. Happy pop. Yay. Like a lollipop. Right, he was like 10 HP or something. Dream Gun, do you have a moment? Today was pretty one-sided. I just keep ending up, I just ended up rab, uh, rambling again. This keeps happening. I should have asked this sooner, but is this leaving you with any mental fatigue? Is your schoolwork being affected? I am completely fine. Really? Thank goodness. I was worried. Not every guy wants a middle-aged weirdo <laughs> rambling to them about a bunch of philosophical abstracts. I know it's a lot to ask, or I know it's asking a lot, but it'd be great if we could keep, or what, or the station, sorry, I think the, the tourist needs help, I better go. Hold on, or Shijinko station, and you, oh, you've got no money, uh, a what? <laughs> I'm just trying to be helpful. Uh, I think I'll hang out with soldier if I can, but I'll do that later, since it's Good time to head out.
Oh, we can't hang on Soldier Shield. No. That's okay. We'll just do the beef bowl. Uh, let me just teleport there so I remember for next time. Uh, but yeah, it's been good. Hopefully I can actually work there. I'm pretty sure I can. I think it's like every day of the week. Except for like weekends or something. Uh, we can check the calendar real fast before I go. Yep, we can go. Yep, every day of the week. Yep. It's kind of cool, it actually tells us what we did in the past. But anyways, yeah, we can work at the beef bowl shop every day. Anyway. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I will catch you guys later.